up my like actual stream on the other platforms today. Hi, how are you guys? Hello, happy Monday. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> Hello. I mean, it's a big haul, you guys. 200 pounds. Um, I haven't had this big of a haul in a hot minute, too. I'm trying to find my stream. Oh, there it is. Okay. Ooh, okay, there we go. Oh, that's cool. Okay, I haven't, sorry, I haven't looked at, like, hey, how are you? Hi, Mia Mai. Hi, everybody. I haven't looked at, like, my YouTube stream when it's like up in like multi-crossing, multi-streaming. I don't know how you say that. So I wanted to see what it looked like and that's actually really cool. Okay. Anyways, I just wanted to see. Anyways, <laughs> I was talking to myself. Hi Cheyenne, how are you? Giveaway number one for rippies. Running right now. Um, all right. So we have a different show. We have not done a show like this in a hot minute. There is no back wall and no rack of hanging clothing because <laughs> I went to the bins this morning and got 200 pounds of clothing. So we are gonna go through it and my enormous pile. I honestly don't know how I fit all of this in carts. This all fit in one cart. <laughs> I have no idea how. Um, but yeah, so we have 200 pounds to go through. Women's, a little bit of men's and kids. Um, a pretty good amount of kids as well and i was gonna tag many because i didn't get a second to uh message her and i'm gonna tell her i do have boy stuff i don't know if i'll find her account let me see no literally the cart was so heavy today i was like oh shit like this is gonna be like a big big haul and it wasn't as big as i've like had it in the past but it was getting back up there which is a good thing and most of it was really good today too hi emma how are you um okay i'm gonna tag maddie really quick hi uh i do have some boys clothing <laughs> today okay there we go uh but anyways hi marissa how are you so we've got a bunch to go through i started putting little sneaky peekies on instagram and i do have some pieces that have been claimed today so, um we're gonna be fair and i'm gonna leave if i do come across something that has been claimed it is just gonna be put to the side so i will let you guys know if there is an item that's claimed but mostly everything that you guys see today is going to be available hi hannah i'm doing all right <laughs> Um, I also kind of went through it already, um, literally just the tops of each of the bags, and I did put a tote aside of stuff that's going to the storefront, so that way you guys don't get, like, teased as I'm showing it, um, but if you guys want to haul a little bit later tonight, um, I will do a haul of the tote of stuff I pulled for the storefront as well. A wasp? Oh my gosh, he was, like, out for that's scary. Wasps are, like, aggressive for no reason. <laughs> like, I love bees. Like a wasp, I'm sorry. <laughs> they can just stay far, far away. I'm sorry about your it's your finger, right? Oh, and that sucks. I hopefully it wasn't like an important finger and hopefully it feels better soon. Uh, but but yeah, yeah. So I have a whole tote over there that we can go through as well today. Yes, so so see the plan is actually once I get into the storefront, we'll go back to being regular on my website restocks as well because I'll actually have the space to do so. Basically what happens is once I leave this home office, this office will turn into Lucas and I's shared space and we're going to share a portion of it for photo taking, for listings, for the buy it now section and my website. And then at my storefront will be my stream room where I'll be streaming. And then of course, where you can shop in person as well. So basically the the whole thing, oh, that's so true. They were like, what's that bling bling? <laughs> um, but hopefully you feel bad. I feel better because yeah, these things hurt. I got stung in the butt by a wasp one time and I still remember it. So anyways, <laughs> um, but yeah, so website will hopefully be back up and running. It's running right now. I mean, you're welcome to go check it out, but it has not been updated in a hot minute. Yay! Hi Maddie! I tagged you because I didn't respond. To, I don't know if I responded or not to you, but I did end up finding more boy stuff in here. So I would say yes, I do have some. Uh, but, but yeah, so anyways, website's on hold right now. You're welcome to check it out if you want. But like I said, it's pretty old stuff. <laughs> um, so it'll be restocked hopefully. I would give it like a month. So about a month before I get moved into the storefront and I actually have time to come out here and set up the new photo room. So <laughs> it's a little bit of like a cycle right now. We're in this process of like opening my storefront if you missed it. May 1st is the grand opening. So I'm kind of trying to focus on that while also trying to stay here as consistent as possible because as you know, I am like 70% whatnot. So this is like my 
partially like full income. So I still need to make sure I'm showing up for you guys and for myself as well, because you know, the bills don't stop, unfortunately. So, um, <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you, Hannah. I really appreciate that. So thank you so much. I seriously, I appreciate every time you say anything. So I really am grateful for you. Um, but yeah, anyway, so it's just a little hectic, <laughs> but we're getting through it. Um, I also have today at 530. So I'm probably gonna hop off here at five. Yeah, probably at five PST. So in two hours from now, I'm gonna hop off because I have my first therapy appointment today. Um, the first therapy for like the the classes that I'm doing, my mental health. So that's happening tonight. Uh, a two hour class every Monday. So and tonight's the first night. So my anxiety is a little high as well. So if I ramble a lot tonight, that's probably why. Um, <laughs> but that is on the back of my mind because I just don't know what to expect. It's completely new for me. So giveaways running. We're going to get started. This is completely new um, for some of you guys. If you are newer here, we are just going to pull. Cheyenne, congratulations. You are a lucky duck. Congrats. So basically what's going to happen is I'm going to pull these bags up and we're just going to go through them. If you like something, you can tell me to run it. I can also just run it right away. That's probably going to be easier. Hi, Sarah. How are you? Just run the items if you guys want. And then if it gets too boring, you tell me, okay? Um, we're going to kick it off with a good one. I was so excited to find this. <laughs> this is a kid's Patagonia puffer jacket. It's like in a magenta pink. It does have a little bit of wear to it, but honestly, it's in pretty freaking great condition. Uh, but it is Patagonia and it is 12 to 18 months and it's a puffer freaking jacket. And I don't think it's reversible, but it has a really cute light pink on the inside. Seriously, even if you have to hold on to this for 12 months, you don't have a kid yet, I think it's worth it. And these things, they pack down so good. I almost kept it for our future kiddo. Um, <laughs> oh, yay. Well, I hope you love it, Sarah. Hi. Hi, Cedar. How are you? Okay, let's kick off the show with this one because this is a goodie. Here we go. Running right now. $5, you guys. Patagonia for kids. 12 to 18 months. I know that these go for like 80 plus dollars. So still. Um, and I think it's down filled as well. Like it has a really good puff to it. I'm glad you're good. Nice little hood. Full zip up. Has the baby pink details. And it's a kid's 12 to 18 months. But yeah, so this is how we're going to do the format today we're just gonna hang out kind of go through everything okay <laughs> Kelly you're like come on come on girl <laughs> just just one more season <laughs> but you gotta imagine too like you're like it's either spring or next year. you're like can you fit into this next year <laughs> no sage it's been so rainy and like dreary today cedar thank you so much for kicking off the show I appreciate you thank you so much um this is gonna be a really cute little spring jacket but yeah, anyways, <laughs> no, it's so dreary. Lucas came outside to help me unload my car with all of this stuff. And he was like, ew, it's so gross outside right now. And I was like, no, it really is. Like, it's just depressing. Okay, let's do this one next. Oh man, you guys, it's such a good day. Um, this one is cashmere. It's 100% cashmere. It does have a little hole right here, but it's from Bloomingdale's. There it is. And it's a huge blanket scarf. So it's cashmere by Bloomingdale's, one size, two ply cashmere, 100%. And it is so soft. It's a huge scarf too. Like this thing is so warm. Um, yeah, I was gonna say it's so hard not to find it, but honestly, you're gonna put this on and it's so like chunky that you really can't see the hole and it's not super noticeable and we've talked about it before if you are anywhere like close to like knowledge of embroidery you could easily put a little flower right there and no one would know um so here we go Reading right now this one was bloomingdale's and it's 100 percent cashmere really big kind of like a blanket scarf style and a beautiful slate gray and it's so soft we have bloomingdale's on that one too but yeah so and if you guys don't claim it no worries i hope you guys know i'm not I'm not mad at all if you guys don't claim anything because it's just gonna get sorted for future drops um that's why I was saying, if you guys would prefer, I just ask if you want me to run things, we can also do it that way. You guys tell me, do you prefer it ran right away or do you guys want to request it? Baby Bowden, 12 to 18 months. This one is so cute. 12 to 18 months, Baby Bowden. It has little lace on the sleeves here and it's a little dress with jungle animals. Um, this is so cute for spring. And then we have, let's see. But yeah, so I'll try to like also grab random, but just know that sometimes at the bins, you kind of just pull like sizes in a similar section. So yeah, I don't know. Hi, how are you, Pear? Okay, so I won't run it unless you guys request then, okay? Unless you guys want me to run them. Here, we'll do a poll. <laughs> Hi, Pear. Let's do a poll. That way you guys don't have to put it in the chat. Create a poll. Run right away or request run request 
there you guys go okay now you vote <laughs> hi ted how are you this one is um columbia and it is a size medium in women's omni heat and it's like a true water repellent too oh okay it's like tied right now so you guys have to break the tie <laughs> but yeah tag to size medium columbia it's like a nice rain jacket and it's a really pretty dark blue as well um right now it's saying run so we'll just go ahead and run them then okay and then if the poll changes at all at some point we can just change with the poll <laughs> um let me make this a little minimized there we go so it's not in our face but yeah here we go running right now for you guys this one was columbia size medium in women's full rain jacket and a nice like cobalt blue and then it has like a um, charcoal gray that comes through it as well but yeah thanks for answering the poll so fast i really appreciate that and if you guys have any requests and you want me to run something you just let me know so if somebody changes their mind on that baby bowden as well totally fine j crew and here we'll do five seconds that way you guys don't have to wait a super long time either so five seconds and this one was j crew and a size medium it's a little blazer jacket this one is really cute running right now size medium j crew and it's a nice little blazer kind of like a soft yeah i do have the stanley um it's i'm really sad because it does have a flaw with it and i didn't realize that until after i had like went through my cart and i was like no <laughs> so it does have a flaw but i am absolutely down to run it for you guys um um, it just depends, Chiz. I do find a lot of new with tags pieces, and there's a lot today that's new with tags, but I um, usually am secondhand based. This one is a little vintage yellow sweater. I thought this would be so cute with springtime coming up. Uh, but yeah, so expensive, honestly. Townhouse size large, and it's like a little yellow sweater. And here we go running, just in case anybody wants that. Isn't that cute? It has like the little cable knit designs to it, and it's vintage townhouse size large. It's really soft, too. Okay, and then we have. I'm trying to like mix it up because I know that like I said like I grabbed a lot of kids stuff in certain sections so I'm trying to like be cautious of that chick collection size small um and this one's like a little blue striped piece this would be cute with the boho coastal theme but yeah so basically like instead of like going and sorting this stuff right away I just decided to like give it to you guys first makes sense uh but so hopefully you guys enjoy this for like honestly like I said I haven't done this in a really long time um, <laughs> I literally, it's all in my cart and it just stays just like the cover photo. It stays just like that. I go out to my car and then I bag it all in the parking lot because it is too much to try and do in the store. I have a lot of extra small on these ones, high-waisted little capris, and they have a really good adjustable waistband as well. All right. And there's zippers in the back pockets of those ones. But yeah, no, <laughs> it's, it's like a balancing act. Honestly, I look like a dork usually going through the store too, because I can't see over the cart. So I just look awkward. <laughs> uh, but this one is uh, Arizona for kids and it's a size, this one is a size medium or a size eight and it's running right now. This one is in pre-loved condition. Most items are going to be pre-loved unless stated that it is new. Um, two seconds left. All right. I wish that was just a category for some, <laughs> um, that would be so much easier. Anyways, size large DKNY. This one is really cute. It's like a burgundy color. Oh, this is nice. DKNY size large on this one. Um, mountain sweatshirt <laughs> sunset. I actually I'm claiming it for my personal collection, but if I part with it, I'll let you know. Okay. Size large on this one. And I, I think I already pulled it too, but I found an airy sun. Um, it's like a little mountain season crew neck. I put it on Instagram as a little sneak peek because it's so freaking cute. Um, but yeah, I pulled it for myself because it's an extra large and I'm going to try and keep it, uh, but if I don't pull it in like the next weeks for me and myself to like wear, I will sell it for you guys. I will not hold on to it. Yeah, it was really cute. Yeah, yeah, it was put into my personal collection. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, there's another piece tonight that I think I put in my personal as well. You guys are going to be really upset about it, but I'll show it to you guys. You guys are going to be mad. <laughs> One sec, let me find it. It's so sick though. Here, I'll find the mountain collection one too so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So you don't have the FOMO. <laughs> well, you'll have the FOMO because I'm keeping it, but um, finders keepers. <laughs> no, it's it's airy. It's an extra large and it has an oil spot too. Um, that was the other thing too. I was like, I think I'm just going to add it to my personal collection and try and maybe like remove that myself. Uh, but don't show it. But yeah, so it's just like a little airy crew neck and then it has mountains, um, mountain season coming down the side there. But yeah, and that's why I was like, I'm, I'm just going to keep it for myself. <laughs> Bradley's causing FOMO. Okay. I feel like this is the one that you guys might have some beef with me, but I was like, this is literally my style, <laughs> but it's literally house plants. Isn't that cute? And it's from Paxson. 
But yeah, I literally was like, that's mine as well. <laughs> so anyways, okay, next, what we're doing now. Side medium, and these ones were just Forever 21 biker shorts. It, yeah, that's rude, I know, I'm sorry. I told you guys, <laughs> biker shorts medium Forever 21, they have like ruching in the base band, little daisies. These would actually be so cute with little um, graphic tees. Um, Alpha Flippin has a TikTok. Oh, no way. Joy, I've um, watched a few videos. I know that Dawn Power Wash is going to be like my best friend. So that's probably what I'm going to do, honestly. <laughs> um, honestly, that's what I was thinking too, is I might just like, if it doesn't come out with a wash, I'll probably just um, like bleach it or like reverse dye it. Yeah, yeah. I would look up on YouTube. Honestly, YouTube has a lot of great advice. Okay, this next one, I almost like, but I felt like it kind of fit the, uh, the idea of the boho coastal and it's like a little shawl and it has like a cream off white color to it that's like a dye i don't know how to explain it i'm gonna try washing it to make sure it's not like flawed but isn't that pretty and it's a size large extra large but if you guys want me i can run into this one for a dollar just because i like i said need to wash it but i just thought that was so pretty a little kimono i think i've decided that i'm going to do vintage um or not vintage uh what's i gonna say oh for the the drop at my storefront, the two drops I'm deciding on. I think I decided the first one is gonna be the Earthy Tones Neutrals. And then I think I'm gonna do the second one as, so going by. <laughs> um, the second one I'm gonna do is both Coastals as like my first introduction to the storefront. I think those are like my top performing drops. So it's probably smart to start with those. I don't know though, I'm so scared. <laughs> size seven and kids, this is just a little jumpsuit. I thought this was really cute, size seven and kids. And it's kind of like a wide leg. Oh, thanks, Sage. This is one of my favorites. I finally found it. <laughs> it was at the bottom of my laundry pile. <laughs> thanks, Sarah. Um, that's what I was kind of thinking, too. I was like, I feel like those are two of my, like, top shows. Um, so I think I'm just going to try and stick to, like, that kind of format. Okay, Lily Pulitzer up next. This one is so cute. Um, but yeah, this hoodie, I found this one a few months ago, and I think I had found extras, too, so I ended up buying them all for you guys, because I was like, well, that's a good deal. Uh, but Lily Pulitzer size 8, and it's like a little patchwork dress. I think it's still voted to run everything. Yeah, sweet. Okay, and let's see. This one is running right now. Lily Pulitzer size 8. It's a little mini dress, and then it ties um, on the sides there as well. This one's so cute. Um, yeah, but anyways, this one is adorable. Lily Pulitzer. It has, like, little seashell prints. There's little pockets in the front right here as well. Dress apart. Thank you so much. That is all yours great pickup oh thank you so much for your first purchase welcome to the swan squad all right and oh, oh. there we go <laughs> couldn't get it on the hanger i picked this one up and i knew it was lily just because of the print yes of course thank you uh but i literally saw it and i was like that's lily and then i picked it up and it was and i was like yes because <laughs> i don't really find a lot of like lily pulitzer okay i feel like i'm keep pulling kids pieces and i'm trying not to pull kids all the time i'm trying to mix it up for you guys this one is a 1x distressed um and it is like this is like the factory distressing like it just has like the wear to it okay <laughs> but it does have distressing in the armpit area so that's what kind of threw me as well but it's urban nation in a 1x and then it has the butterfly print and i'm just going to run this one for a dollar in case anybody does want it size 1x a little distressed butterfly tee i just thought that was so cute though and i feel like i never find um 1x tees so i was really pumped about that <laughs> urban nation it'd be cute with some little high-waisted shorts though i know it's another freaking butterfly sarah <laughs> I, I need to do a butterfly drop, honestly. But every time I'm like, oh, I'll do a butterfly drop, I always put the butterfly stuff in with my other things. Tito's, how are you? Thank you so much. That is all yours. Yeah. <laughs> all right. And then let's do, let's do this one. This one's cute. This is a little Disney tee. I think it's on a Disney tag too. Disney Pixar tag, size medium. And it says, boop. <laughs> um And it is running to a bug show. Okay, that would be fun. What's that called? Ep there's a word for that. that. Like, what's that study called? The study of bugs. Starts with an E, right? Oh, sorry. Size medium on this. Disney Pixar size medium. I'll run it one more time just in case. Entomology. Thank you. An entomologist. Thank you. Thank you. I was going to say, I, I know that there was, uh, but there's a word for it. <laughs> that would be really cool, though. Like an entomology t um, show. Okay. And then that one was a medium. So let me know if you guys need me to run it again or anything. Isn't that cute, though? Okay, this is a little girl's dress and then it comes with the little under um jumper to it as well and it is from first impressions size 24 months 24 months oh i know that would be really cute on halloween honestly that probably will go into the halloween box <laughs> um <laughs> 
<laughs> That's funny, but <laughs> you're like, I have the vet mindset. My bad. <laughs> Hey, it probably would have worked, honestly. Oh, okay, let's do this one. This is pretty. This is a big wicker slash woven bag. I love this one so much. I almost put this aside for the storefront. My music just got really loud. Anyways, there we go. <laughs> um, anyways, I was gonna put this in the storefront, but if anybody wants first dibs on it, I'll let you. It is Soul Society. It's like very clean on the inside as well. It's gonna be a really cute beach bag. And then it has the wicker on the bottom as well. And it's running right now in case anybody wants it. It's cool though. And it's got a lot of space. So honestly, like I said, perfect beach bag. It has room for a little towel and your water bottle, maybe some snacks. <laughs> McKenna, thank you so much. That is all yours. And I've been thinking a lot about like the storefront and like what I want to do for you guys is like a, I don't know, like a new thing to introduce. And I think I am going to try and do one show a week where I basically go through my store's clothing racks. And if you see something you like, you just let me know. And then it would be the price of whatever my store tag is, if that makes sense. I don't know if that will be something you guys are interested in or not. But since my store will already be based on like themes, I feel like it could work. <laughs> um, Disney's tag on this one, Disney Parks, and it's a US 7-8. Kids 7-8 on this one. And it says, let the good times roll. It's like an off-white crew neck. Okay, I'm glad. Okay, well, that's what I was wondering. I was like, I feel like you guys would enjoy that. <laughs> Disney Parks on that one. Running right now. Four seconds left, size 7-8 in kids. Nice little Disney crew neck. All right. And then we have, let's see. I'm trying to mix it up. Let's do, let's do something from here. This one is a Kids Columbia rain jacket. Perfect for the seasons coming up. I don't know if you guys have a rainy season you're coming your way, but for us, we most definitely do. <laughs> this one is an extra small in kids or a size 6, 6X. Um, and be, I think so. Um, it was on Thursday last week or Wednesday. I have the video though. If you want to see it, you can DM me and I can also send it to you. It's on Facebook because I streamed it on Facebook as well. This one was a kid size extra small. Kids extra small running now. Um, and it's like a nice rain jacket. It has lining pockets as well and they zip closed. Um, thank you, Jessica. Five seconds left on this one. Nice little Columbia rain jacket for kiddos. Um, I'm trying to think. I think I was going to do another store tour for you guys. I think a little bit closer to when it's set up because it's kind of a mess right now. Because <laughs> now Lucas and I did our measurements yesterday. So now we know how big like the store is basically. And I moved where the checkout counter is going to be to, I don't know if you guys remember, like the cabinet space that was behind. So the plan is hopefully to be able to have more floor space for racks, um, which is super exciting. So yeah, that'll be perfect. Oh, thank you, Jessica. Um, this next one, you guys, is going to be a dollar start. It's just a little REI fleece zip up. And I didn't realize that it was as flawed as it is. It's in definite play condition. It has some staining and just wear to it. I'll run it for a dollar. No worries if not. And I'll put it to the side. But I will run it because I just took it and put it on the hanger for you. <laughs> and it's REI for kids, size extra small. And it's like a little blue fleece. It has zippers on the um, pockets and up, up the front as well. But yeah, anyways. Hi, Katie. How are you? Hey, I don't know um, what size you're looking little one is but I do have that baby Bowden if you want to see it <laughs> um I think it was 12 to 18 months both of them are I think I ran one earlier didn't I let me pull it forward just in case that way I have it next to me there we go <laughs> um it um that that one was a dollar start because it's flawed and it's a kid's extra small this one is DeMart um and it's a hundred percent I thought it was a hundred percent linen where's the little tag 52 um two percent linen and 48 percent viscose yeah um, Katie one second okay purple floral mini skirt on this one and it was tagged a size where's the size size large linen purple mini skirt on this one it's linen rayon blend and it's gonna hit about knee length I would say maybe a little bit lower if you're wearing a high-waisted um or low-waisted I guess it go lower <laughs> um but, but yeah and then let me yes it's a little bit of a mixed up day so hannah um or not hannah sorry i went to say hannah anderson so baby bowden size 18 to 24 months and this one is like a little jungle printed dress 18 to 24 months and it's running right now uh oh there we go <laughs> um and i still have the other ones too katie we still haven't like barely made a dent in these bags but i know there's a lot more <laughs> thank you katie i'm so glad you're here i literally was gonna message you and be like do you want me to hold these dresses <laughs> I didn't know uh, what size your little one was, but I, I 
was kind of, I, I was like, I'm pretty sure this is the size range. Oh, absolutely. It's so freaking cute. I literally thought of you. <laughs> here, actually, you know what? I think the other one was right here. Where'd it go? Well, there's another one. There's another baby Bowden coming up. It's like a little yellow dress. <laughs> oh, so sweet. Thank you so much. Uh, I appreciate that, Katie. Oh, and her name is Hannah too. Okay, maybe that's, maybe my brain was subconsciously trying to say Hannah when I said Hannah Anderson that's funny i just put that together <laughs> uh but this one is petite betru betu betu 36 months Ooh, 36 months so 3t on this one it's a little floral print peplum style and it's running right now 3t on that one a little floral but yeah the brand it looks very fancy <laughs> it's a little um boat on the tag um and it has a little snap down in the back there as well thank you katie i appreciate it and number seven Thank you thank you okay and then let's see if i can grab something else i know we've done a lot of kid stuff like i said if the kid stuff kind of gets stuck at the top because it's so lightweight <laughs> it's a little bit easier to grab when i'm bagging things up okay this one is a little flannel marisa's size 1x this one is really cute i did a little poll on um like on my uh, Facebook for the grand opening and it was really requested for plus size. So I'm trying to source a bunch of plus size right now. So it starts, oh, I bet your cheeks hurt. <laughs> Quick maths, I was over here trying to do 36. No, that's literally me, Maddie. I was like 36. How many times does 12 go to 36? <laughs> No, they're so good, but my cheeks always hurt so bad after eating them. <laughs> Size 1X. Oh my goodness, I think I buttoned this. Oh no, I see. Oh, ooh, that's cute. Look at the arms. It has like this extra little like chunk of fabric coming through right here. So it's like really boxy. Oh, that's cute. Size 1X on this one. It's running right now. Maurice's nice little neutral lightweight flannel. This is cute though. And it's super soft too. Maurice's always has really nice pieces. I, I don't know why, but I do not hesitate when I find Maurice's any size large and up. I always pick it up because I just think it's so cute. Uh, but thank you, Kombucha. I appreciate you. That is all yours. Number eight. All right. Um, let's see. Let me grab over here. There's a really freaking cute hoodie, but I have no idea where it went. So it's like a, a coral hoodie. You guys are going to love it. And it's an extra large um, American Eagle. It's literally perfect for spring. So hopefully we get to it. It's really bright. So I don't know how I'm not seeing it. Anyways. <laughs> All right. This next one is new with tags from Disney. Oh my gosh. How old is this? This is an old Disney tag. It doesn't say. <laughs> Sorry, random. We're gonna try Kelly. I don't know if we're gonna be able to do it though. I need to speed up if we're gonna try. Disney Store Vintage and it is running right now. Little Minnie Mouse and she's holding her little Statue of Liberty and then the ears are kind of folded back. New with tags on that one. It's Vintage Disney. Yeah, we're gonna have to hustle. <laughs> I'll buy you a Red Bull. <laughs> Sage. Um, I, I would love to stay all night and go through all this with you guys. The issue is that I have an appointment at 5.30 tonight. Ooh, happy early birthday, Shell! Happy birthday! What are you gonna do? Uh, but this next one, a lot of you guys messaged me about, but nobody made a preclaim, so we're running it. This one is plant based, and it is on a mighty fine tag little snap boat, um, snapback on this one, running right now. A little trucker style hat. It could probably use like a little wash, but honestly, it's pretty cute though. A little plant based, um, and I think there's a few other hats today as well. <laughs> All right, and then let's see. We've got. Let's do so another pull from here. This one, this bag right here has a shit ton of kids clothes. Sorry, excuse my language, you guys. Dip size 3T. It's uh 3.30 right now. So I've got like an hour and a half. <laughs> Dip 3T. These ones are little green pants. And then they have a little drawstring as well. Um, these are cute though. Little skinny fit running right now. 3T. Two seconds left on those ones. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, I think you guys are most of you guys are at least two hours ahead of me okay this next one is world market this one is really pretty for the spring i have to figure out how to get it on the hanger really quick because it is a true wrap dress and i'm not going to be able to do this thing justice oh no it's beach lounge sorry beach lounge size large there's also world market <laughs> um did i miss any kiddos before the ones i bought um I will break your heart and show you the one that sold <laughs> the very first one. Uh, but this one is, it was a little Patagonia. <laughs> it was 12 to 18 months too. I'm sorry. Um, and I don't think you've missed a lot of other stuff. 
I know there's a lot more coming up. There's a 24 months I'll pull for you as well um, that did run earlier that did not get claimed. Okay, let's see. How does this one go? So this is a true, true, true wrap dress. It has a little snap over here. It wraps around and it's a spring print in a size large true wrap dress. <laughs> uh, but running right now, I know, right? It's such a good jacket. I'm so glad Cedar grabbed that one. And it does have a stretch in the back as well. So size large and it was beach lounge size large wrap dress. This is actually gonna be really cute with some little wedges for the springtime. Okay, thank you so much. I am so sorry. It's really not getting the justice it deserves. So we're gonna need an outfit of the day. <laughs> thank you, Kay. I appreciate you. And number nine. Yay. Thank you guys. Okay, and then let me run that one again. I don't know if this is something you're into or not, Katie, but this one did run earlier and did not get claimed. And then there was a kid's um, crew neck that didn't get claimed either. Here we go. <laughs> First impressions, and it has little, um, like a little jumper at the bottom as well, 24 months, and running right now. <laughs> Sounds good, okay. I know, wrap dresses, they're so pretty on, and they're always so flattering, but like, I feel like the moment they get on a hanger, it's immediately like, ew, what is that? <laughs> Uh, but getting like a woman's body with flowers and mushrooms uh, blooming from with <gasps> shell that's gonna be so pretty oh my gosh you're gonna have to show us a picture because that's gonna be really cute uh, but that sounds really fun i i know cute i feel like i need to do a tattoo for my birthday i know what i'm asking lucas for <laughs> This next one is a little dog bag. I'm trying to curate a dog show for you guys right now. So I've been picking up a bunch of this stuff. Yes, please do. Uh, but loved by a Sheltie. It's a little tote bag. And this one's just going to be a $3 start. It's running right now for you guys. Loved by a Sheltie. Little tote bag. And it's like brand new as well. I feel like I find so many tote bags. Yeah, I've been working hard on this dog show. It's it's taken some time. It probably will be ready like at the end of summer. But you know, we're getting there. <laughs> Now, all good things come with time, right? Okay, and then let's see. Uh, but yeah, we have a dog show in the works right now and a cat show in the works, a Harry Potter show in the works, and a clown show in the works. <laughs> yes, Sage, he did... Um, he did, ended up not having to have his teeth pulled. He just had to get them cleaned. Yes, and a dinosaur show, except I keep selling you guys the dinosaur stuff that I find. So, so that one is at ground zero right now, but I am working on it. A dinosaur show is definitely in the works. There's a shelf dedicated to it. I just have to actually start filling it. <laughs> no Squishmallows today. No Squishmallows today. I always find Squishmallows at the bins. I just realized that. No, unfortunately not. Um, I will have Squishmallows in two weeks. Okay, and then here we go, you guys. Um, swimsuit in summer. Swimsuit show, yes. Thrift stores break out swimsuits in two weeks. So that's when I can start sourcing that one. And summer is gonna be basically my color drops right now. So if you see any drop that's like spring or um, color like rainbow drop, those or florals, that kind of name on my page, those are all gonna be summer kind of themed. And everything is actually transitioning right now to summer as well so you are going to see a lot more of like summer styles mixed into all shows as well but i will have dedicated shows as well oh and the other one in the works mother maternity show so it'll be maternity clothes baby wearing stuff nursing stuff and i'm missing something else and just like baby toys books and then clothing as well i, I could probably put together a leather show yeah i could probably do that honestly <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I'm really excited for that one, Danny. It's it's taken some time. I hope you're doing well, Danny. Okay, sorry, I'm holding these ones again. Three to six months, and this one is three to six months too. So if somebody wants a bundle of three to six month little pieces, they're little pumpkin ones. So if you're expecting and you have a little baby coming in the fall time, these would be perfect. So there's a little ghost one with pumpkins, and then there is the little pumpkins with little squirrels. Three to six months and three months, I think is what it was three to six months, two way zipper on the first one. And then it is six months planet organic cotton on the second one. Um, and here we go running right now, two pieces on this one, little fall kiddo bundle. Um, I'm just a weakness for kids, like anything fall related. <laughs> I've actually been hoarding fall stuff right now. So come fall time, I hope you guys are ready because I already have three totes ready for you guys. <laughs> Thank you so much, Danny. Um, actually, this is about the time of the year when, when one of my favorite thrift stores calls me up and they go, hey, anything with a long sleeve is a dollar for you. So usually I go stockpile right now and then I hoard them until fall time. So I'm about to hit the jackpot soon and I'm super excited for that. Um, okay, let's do this little bucket hat. This one's cute. This is a little, oh, my shoe just fell off. This is Sonoma, Goods for Life, one size and it's just a little bucket hat. I just, I, I like bucket hats, so here we go. Graphic teaser in two weeks. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, oh yeah. I've been stocking up on Halloween stuff because I find it all the time right 
right now. And running right now, little yellow, or not yellow, it's an off-white, kind of like a creamish colored bucket hat from Sonoma. And it is, I think it's a linen blend too. It feels like it at least. Oh, it's 100% cotton. <laughs> okay, and then here we go next up. Let's see. Man, there's a lot of kid stuff. I'm probably just gonna do this kid stuff on top so that we can get to the adult stuff. Uh, this one is Koala Kids Size 5T. Oh, that would be cute, Kelly. That's probably where it'll end up, honestly, in the Halloween tote. And it's 5T running right now. This one's Koala Kids. It's like a little pea coat, kind of like chore jacket style. And then it's a full button down as well with a little hood in the back there. All right. And then we have, let's see, oh, a set. And I know that there's another piece to it, so I can't run it yet, but I will put it to the side so that I know we can pull it once I find another one. Okay, next up is a romper. It is missing the belt, but this one is so cute. Um, it's Beach Lounge Collection, and it's going to be an extra large vest. Extra large vest and Beach Lounge Collection, and it has wide legs to it as well. Missing the belt, and it's running right now. Size extra large, and it's so cute. I'm pretty sure it's a linen blend as well, so it's really soft, nice and lightweight, and it does have a double layer to it at the top there, so it's not going to be see-through. Thank you, Bargain. How are you? Thank you so much. All right, number 11. Ooh, these stickers are just not stickering. I must have like switched brands or something without knowing it, because I feel like, <laughs> I feel like the stickers are not what they used to be. Okay. This one is Lake lake bum this one's cute it's kind of like a um a, like an acid wash distressed look to it lake bum on this one tagged a size small by a vintage apparel and it is running right now lake bum size small on this one the stickers just aren't stickering <laughs> i'm like i don't know why they are not working but they are just not working with me all right and then we have let's see oh, this one is a nursing bra speaking of maternity and nursing wear this one is i believe wireless as well yeah, wireless bra um, by Auden 34 Triple D. And it's a maternity nursing bra. The straps are just really twisty right now. 34 Triple D Auden nursing bra. And then it does have like the uh, built in padding, but no wires on this one. Auden's a really comfy brand and it's running right now. If anybody wants that one, a nice little neutral nursing bra 34 Triple D. And then it does have the little clasps that come down as well nice little nude wireless bra. All right. And then I have, let's see. Um, I'm trying to get, let's see. I'm just going to like, there we go. <laughs> that worked. Um, man, I really don't know how I get all this in a cart. Honestly, like the moment I start like going through this, I realize how much I actually got. And I'm like, oh, oh, wow. Oh, Riley, you have no self-control. <laughs> Okay, this one is a little dress, floral print, and it is Japan size extra small. This is gonna be really cute in the fairy tale romance drop. It ties around the waist as well, size extra small, keyhole in the back there, nice little ruffle detail, and it does have some stretch to it as well. Extra small. Four seconds left. I think it reset back to 10 seconds because for some reason it is just not, <laughs> it is not running at five seconds. But yeah, and it ties through the back or you can tie it in the front if you'd prefer a bow detail to it. Yay, thank you, Kathy. I appreciate that. That is all yours, number 12. Thank you, thank you. Okay, then we've got, oh, this one's a little floral dress. This one's really pretty size. It's by Las Amis and it's a size large, little black and white floral dress. And then it flares out. It's going to be midi length and it does have tears to it, kind of like a baby doll fit. And it's running right now, size large on this one. Oh, this is so cute. This would be a good one to pair with some little docks. And it does have pockets as well. Size large, very stretchy, has a nice stretchy waistband to it as well. And it's like the perfect midi length. This is like my favorite length of dress right now where it hits just under your knee. It's so freaking cute and they always twirl so well. Cheyenne, thank you so much much. Very stretchy, size large. Cheyenne, thank you. That is all yours. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Number 13. All right. Oh, I haven't been telling you guys like the prices that are on the Goodwill tags. I feel like that's like the funniest part about it. Dog limited, size large. Um, and this one says DWA dogs with attitude. And it says doglimited.com on there. And it's just a t-shirt size large on this one. And it's running right now. Size large, good stretch to it as well. <laughs> <laughs> Emerald green slip dress I got from you. It had pockets. I found a pair of earrings in the pockets. What? <laughs> We were just talking about this shovel. We were talking about this last week where I was like, I wonder how many times I miss something in a pocket. Um, like how many times, because I, I usually check all of the pockets, but 
I'm selling like how many pieces a week, you know? So like sometimes like I just like, I miss a pocket or there's like a hidden pocket. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah, the front of it. And let's see, I missed another question. I need you to find me a pair of docks. What size, Lily? I have eight pairs of docks in stock right now. Hi, Claude, how are you? Oh, good. I'm so glad you love it. Seven and a half. I might have a pair. DM me, um, DM me, okay? And let me know. I'm so glad, Claude. I'm glad you love it. Thanks for letting me know. <laughs> both earrings. Well, hey, honestly, both earrings. That's impressive. You got like a nice little bonus. <laughs> well, thanks for letting me know. That's hilarious though. Okay, this next one, I am pulling this one. I tried to find it before the show so I wouldn't tease you guys. If somebody is interested in it, I would more than happily um, work out a deal with you. I'm gonna tie this really quick so it doesn't undo itself, but this is Intimately Free People. And it's tagged an extra small, but Free People I feel like is very um, all over the place with their sizing. And I would say it probably would fit up to a size medium. If you wanted some extra boobage showing, you could probably get away with the size large. This thing is stunning. It is a beautiful, kind of like a high neckline. I'm trying to get it so it looks right. Here we go. High neckline free people dress. If anybody wants this, I will run it right now for 15 for you guys. But it is a mid-length, beautiful piece and like it's absolutely stunning. Like this would be so pretty to wear for like a little vacation or like a date night. It ties in the back to adjust it. Um, and then it has this beautiful floral print at the bottom there. Isn't that gorgeous? But yeah, so if anybody wants it, I'll run it right now just in case. And it's tagged a size extra small. I would say probably up to a medium. I would keep it, but I feel like my boobs might fall out the side. Um, <laughs> but it is pretty, pretty close to a one size. I'd say maybe up to a medium comfortably. And if anybody wants it right now, intimately free people and it's full length maxi i'm five five and it hits the ground on me but yeah i just thought that was so gorgeous but i do need to kind of like stock up a few pieces for my next storefront like my storefront opening so i apologize <laughs> uh but yeah you know i <laughs> i don't want any boobage coming out the side so i'm probably gonna pass on it <laughs> next up you guys this one is by the brand organic mom and i don't know if it had a size tag Sometimes the tags are in the funkiest places. No size tag, dang it. Um, it's a little like PJ set. It has the fox on the front here. It says organic mom. And then it has the little foxes coming down the sides. And then over here, you get your matching pants. Oh wait, there's a tag still on these ones. Size 80 centimeters. Oh, someone in here is a math whiz. What is the 80 centimeters? Is that 80 centimeters would be 12 months? No. I can't do the math. <laughs> well, it's 80 centimeters. It's a, um, a kid's PJ set by Organic Mom. And it is running right now. If you guys know your centimeters, uh, but you get lucky. Okay, 90 is 2T. So it'd be 18 to 24 months or, or 12, to, 12 to 18 months, maybe. Anyways, <laughs> if anybody wants to pull out, I always just refer to the Hannah Anderson size chart because that one is like the most accessible for me at least. So <laughs> sorry guys. Um, and then let's see, this one is cotton on for kids in a size eight and it's like a little floral print. It's kind of like a retro print. Um, cotton on for kids running right now in a size eight and it's very stretchy. It's their little tee with the flower print, little retro groovy feel. Yeah, I was gonna say, I think the, the size ranges for kiddos size in, in centimeters also very doesn't it <laughs> um and then this one is a kid's little kind of button up it's by play up 36 months play up 36 months nice little neutral and it is running sorry this one i'm trying to change it to three dollars for you guys there we go 36 months nice little kind of like neutral henley for you um the squishmallows uh no oh no squishmallows ashley i see you're looking at the cover photo huh those ones were claimed um unfortunately last week in my squishmallow show but i will have another squishmallow uh show next week i believe i think it's next week or the week after <laughs> um next up you guys this one is a kids 11 and that's all it says is just an 11 and it does have a little oil spots on it in the front here so i'm gonna run this one for oh up there yeah those ones are mine too i'm sorry those are the personal collection i'm gonna run this one for a dollar it's just a kids um uh, it's tagged an 11 which i'm not really sure what that's gonna equate to for kids sizing maybe it's on the back here let me see nope 
yeah it doesn't really say so i'm gonna say that probably like a kid's like extra small small one dollar running right now and it's like a little colorful dinosaur print it's really cute though um baby yoda and the mini oh yeah oh i see oh i love that ashley yeah i will have squishmallows probably in two weeks i would say to play it safe thank you danny um so if you go on my profile there's a squishmallow show scheduled and you're welcome to bookmark that one and i do start my starts um for squishmallows at three bucks but yeah, so that'll be next next week or the week after. I, I'm, my weeks are so mixed up right now. I apologize. Uh, but next up, you guys, this one is a little plus size floor length maxi. It's so pretty. This one is actually no boundaries, size extra, extra large. But like, I never find plus size dresses. So I was very excited to find this. But now I'm realizing I think there is a little little spot. That sucks. We're going to pull it. Um, Sage, we did do a scrub show a long, long time ago. <laughs> And I don't know if I would do one again, but I can always source um, scrubs like by request as well. Thank you, Zan. Okay, so it's a little bit further out. <laughs> um, I have two pairs of figs in stock right now. I think they're extra larges. If you're interested, message me. Okay, these ones do not have a size. They're little horse pants for kids. <laughs> They're so cute though. Um, little horse pants for kids. I'm going to say probably like a 2T. Um, and they are just going to run for a dollar as well. I just, anytime I find like horse related or Western stuff, I always pick it up for you guys because I just think it's so cute, especially when it's like kid sizing. So running right now. Oh, I see the size tags on the outside. This is what I was talking about where it's so random. Oh, okay, Sage. Just kidding. That don't message me. <laughs> Katie, thank you. It's organic mom 110 cents centimeters or got organic mom 110 centimeters on that one so that would be 24 months I believe oh man I need to I need to study my sizes <laughs> thank you Katie yeah of course all right and then let's see we have I'm trying to mix it up for you guys let's do this one this is frog talks so really good outdoors brand this one does have some wear to it um but this is a really nice rain jacket by frog talks and a size small in women's um yeah lily okay i never have either but then all of a sudden i've been finding kids clothes with all of the tags on the outside so i don't know if it's like maybe it's like boutiques that do it i'm not sure i'm still learning so much about kids clothing right now um so i don't actually know why but i feel like it's always like the fancier brands that have it on the outside and i never knew that and now it's like anytime i see a tag on the outside i'm like oh i'm just gonna pick that up just in case <laughs> frog togs on this one it's like a charcoal gray rain jacket and a women's small it does have some wear to it there's a little wear mark on the back right here um it might be honestly sage i'm not really sure i'll have to look that up after the show now now i want to know frog dog size small um hey baby oh gosh you're in here to tell me what the heck i haven't come to see you huh <laughs> i've been hiding <laughs> not really i've been so busy um i'm trying to open up the storefront so i've been just kind of like all over the place you know <laughs> so i promise you i'm trying to take the time to come out there i just need to message you and i need to just schedule a time and force myself to be like no i'm busy i have this i need to do <laughs> so i am so sorry this next one you guys is zelda 2019 and it's brand new with the tags um yeah i i um open on may 1st we've got the storefront opening may 1st zelda new with tags on this one little snapback running right now for you guys this one's sick thanks baby um zelda New with tags, nice little snapback. Shout out to the lake. Um, I don't know if he's in here today, but he gave me this one at <laughs> the bins. Thank you, baby. That is all yours. Great pickup. Um, but yeah, anyways, I opened the storefront May 1st, so I'm kind of just in the moving in process right now. I've been trying to get it all together and get ready for it all. It's been a process in <laughs> downtown. Oh, perfect. Well, that'd be perfect then, BB. I, I figured there'd be somebody that would want something like that. So thank you. Um, downtown, um, right at the beginning of downtown, if you go drive by the American Legion and look to your left, it's um, the little blue building and it says on the window, so once we find <laughs> this next one, you guys, is a kid's size 10, 12. Nice little puffer. Thank you. Yeah, I've been working on it in the behind the scenes, kind of. This is nice, you guys. Oh my gosh. Talk about some good jackets for kids today this is down filled it does have a few little feathers coming out of it um i wouldn't say play condition though honestly it's in pretty decent condition for a kid's jacket sherpa lined on this one north face for kids in a size medium or a 10 12 running now kids medium or a 10 12 has the zipper down here pockets on both sides of it as well that snap closed and then it does have like i was saying like it's down filled so there's little feathers but not really 
that's like literally the only thing I can see that's wrong with it. Size medium. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much, baby. Honestly, I, I might message you if I'm if I'm needing some extra heat from a Rex, okay? <laughs> thank you. Teresa, thank you. That is all yours. Great pickup. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I know I've got a few people that have messaged so far being like, hey, you looking to do some buyouts? And I'm like, give me a second. <laughs> but yes, uh, but I probably will be looking for some inventory outlets just for the beginning, at least to get settled into the place. Size extra large Jordan. Um, Nike up next. True. You are local. <laughs> um, Nike Air Jordan on this one. It has a tiny, teeny, tiny pinhole on the whole um, sleeve right here. Air Jordan coming down the sleeve. Tomorrow is an all Nike show, by the way. If you guys have not yet, go bookmark it. It's all Nike. Um, this one is running. Oh, wait, is that a little spot? Where'd it go? I see it on the light, but I don't see it. I don't really see it, but we'll run it for a dollar. Let's run it for a dollar for you guys. Nike, extra large on this one, running right now for you guys. There we go. Um, no, oh yes, actually, there are some plush. I'll pull a plush right after this for you. Nicole, how are you? Extra large Air Jordan, Nike Air on that one. Really pretty purple, long sleeve on that one. Two seconds left. Uh, but yeah, I'll pull a plush right after this. I think we've got a lot of Disney plush today. Thank you, Nicole. No, I don't think we had Grogu, though. I know somebody was asking for Grogu. Okay, I'll put the Stanley out here, too, so I don't forget about it. Like I said, though, don't get your hopes up. It does have a flaw. Okay, let's do this one, and then let's grab a plush. Oh, I grabbed two plush. <laughs> um, oh, sick. Okay, sweet. Oh, let's see. Let me grab that one. Orange plaid. Oh, this one. Oh, that's cute, too. Okay, let me set down a little pile right here. Hi. <laughs> Why is this one so heavy? This is a vintage poo, but he's really heavy. 1997. Oh, he's got a battery back here. It is a stitch. I'll run him right after this. Okay, he's got a big battery pack right um, back here. So he must be a... I don't know what he does. Here we go. We're going to run him for you guys, though. He's 1997 Vintage Poo running right now for you guys. He sits up on his own and has a battery pack. So he might like, you might have to put batteries in him. If you squeeze him, he goes, no, literally, I am terrified for the day that I have kids and they have talking toys because toys terrify me. I used to work in a preschool and hmm, those toys are haunted. <laughs> Um, Sarah, thank you so much. That is all yours. I'm glad you like him. Um, yes, all clothing, but we're also doing shoes. And then I'm also, um, doing a few like books. I'm going to have like one little bookshelf, I think. And then probably some like collectibles and just like trinkets as well. Mm no webkins today but i do find webkins in my plus shows okay next one was the little stitch <laughs> he's so cute <laughs> he looks so innocent oh but he's disney park tagged as well disney park tag he is literally the cutest thing ever why does his head tilt like that that is so cute <laughs> Here we go. He's ready right now for you guys. He, and he's super soft. Oh my gosh. I just can't get overweight. Like his head just tilt <laughs> my heart. Um, you got any sick kicks for BB size? No, I don't. Um, I wish I did. I'll tell Lucas that's what you're looking for though. Cause he has better luck finding that kind of stuff. Oh, thank you, Angie. I appreciate you. That he's so cute. Oh my goodness. Oh gosh. I was not expecting him to be that cute. Okay. The next one is a little black. Groot is not for sale. Groot's part of my personal collection. I'm so sorry. Um, this one is the future is female one size. It's a little black baseball cap. Oh, it actually fits my head too. That's impressive. Um, running right now, the future is female. It's kind of like an acid wash black baseball cap and it's embroidered as well by David and young. And it does have an adjustable back to it as well. Two seconds left on that one. Future is female. All right, and then we have the one little blouse, and this one was a uh, size small. Lauren Conrad, size small. Uh oh, the puffs aren't puffing. There we go. Size small on this one, and running right now for you guys. Ooh, Vegas Toy Con. That sounds fun. Are you driving there, or are you guys like taking a trailer? That's the best way to do it. I feel like. Um, or are you just going to like be there? That's cool. Um. I would say maybe, depending on your chest size, because it has quite a bit of boxiness to it, though. 
I would say probably. It's going to be a pretty oversized small. I'll run it one more time just in case. Um, I can grab a pit to pit if you would like. It does have a quite like a quite a bit of flow to it with the peplum. Um, but yeah, let me know if you want me to grab a pit to pit and I can do that too. Thanks, see, I appreciate you. Eight seconds left on that one. It's cute though. This is going to be a cute for the piece for the springtime too. <laughs> All right. Is Groot? No, Groot is not for sale. He is part of my personal collection. Thank you, C. All right. And then let's see this grab. Let's see. We're almost done with this bag. Let's do another little flush for you guys. And then we'll do this bag. And then we'll keep pulling from these other bags. Sorry. Um, this next one is Eco Pals. Less plastic is fantastic. Wildlife artists. And it's a little red panda, I think. <laughs> I'm like, I think it's a red panda. Okay, thank you. I'm getting better at my identifications. <laughs> Running right now. Little um, red panda for you guys. And he was from Eco Pals. Ooh, hiccup. Oh, we're almost at an hour in. That's so funny. It literally is an hour in every time. Okay, and then we have... This is a big tote bag. It's really nice, actually. If I ever do the merch, like I keep saying I'm going to, I kind of want these kind of tote bags. It zips closed, so it's going to be really nice for a little market day, especially if you carry your wallet in the canvas bag. And then it says on the front, it says, it takes strength to be kind. Daniel Labunski, uh, which is the founder of Kind, and it's just a really nice tote bag. So here we go running right now for you guys. Nice black tote bag. It zips closed, and then it does have the nice little quote, and then it's plain on the other side as well. And it was by the brand Kind, um, which is like the Kind Bars, and it's made in the USA. All right, and then we have, oh, I've got like a leaning tower over here. This one's a little kid's dress. I was wondering where that, oh, it fell on the side. Okay, I found the other baby boat in. I don't know if you're still in here or not, Katie, but I did find it, so I'll run it after this. Bonnie Jean size six. Yeah, Shell, so I, gosh, I, I've been following it. I have not watched it yet, but I've been following all of that stuff, and Honestly, I, I lost my childhood a long time ago, but that just kind of added to it. Uh, but, but yeah, it's definitely on my list of things I want to watch. Size six on this one, and it's like a little girl's dress, kind of like a denim dress with a blue and red ruffle to it. This is really pretty. Um, but yeah, it, it really, you know, it put a lot into perspective, you know, because I, I remember watching shows and being like, why does this make me uncomfortable? And I never really knew why. And then as I've gotten older, I'm like, oh, that's why. <laughs> awesome so yeah it's just it's sad you know it's just like why <laughs> makes me mad okay and then let me run this baby bowden really quick before i forget this one was the baby bowden 18 to 24 months the little yellow dress kind of similar to the little jungle print one running right now baby bowden on that one and then snaps up in the back as well a little yellow striped dress it's so cute though all right two seconds left on that one and then we'll keep on grabbing and then if he comes back in here, somebody remind me so I can tell her that we did run it. Okay, let's do this one next. I think this is another kid's piece. Oh my goodness, I did not realize how many pieces of kids I found today. Garage extra small up next. Oh yeah, Katie, it was 12 to 18 months if somebody wants to let her know. <laughs> uh, but running right now. And this one was Colorado and it was Bowden too. I don't know if she heard that. Extra small on this one. Colorado extra small. And then I'll put it there too. Bowden, 12 to 18. There we go. Oh, it said Biden instead. <laughs> and here, I'll run it one more time. Ready right now. Baby Bowden. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's baby Biden, if you were wondering. Nice little yellow dress, 12 to 18 months. <laughs> That'd be quite the, quite the clothing brand. <laughs> All right, and then next up, oh, this one is really pretty, and I, I think this one was actually supposed to be pulled. I'm sorry, I'm not even going to show it to you guys, because you guys are going to be like, what? He came up with a clothing light. Yeah, he's he's trendy now. You didn't know? Uh, but next up, and it's it's a baby clothing light as well, <laughs> even trendier. Size 5, or and this one is going to be 110 centimeters, so a size 5, 6 on this one for kids. Um, and they're little kind of like balloon pants, and then they have little pockets as well. These are so cute. And then they were by the brand no brand it just says like the five six on these ones and they are running right now for you guys i know literally i was like why are these not adult sizing these are so cute and i love that they have the pockets too they're kind of like little balloon pants hi kenny how are you welcome in all right and then next up you guys this one is um oh this one's another cutie this one is hannah anderson 18 to 24 months hannah anderson 18 to 24 months and it's a little rubber ducky onesie 
How freaking cute is that? Snaps across the front as kind of like a wrap and it's 100% organic cotton. Organic cotton on that one, 18 to 24 months. Isn't that adorable? I love this one so much. It's another perfect spring piece. Hannah Anderson, 80 centimeters on that one. Isn't that cute? Okay, let me know if you guys want me to rerun them. They're adorable. I was very excited to find all of them. <laughs> oh, here's the card heart for Lucas. I'm putting this one to the side for him. Okay, Animal Crossing up next. This one's cute. I can't believe nobody got those ones. They're so cute. Animal Crossing Kids Extra Large. Kids Extra Large on this one, little Animal Crossing, and it's running right now for you guys. There we go. Kids Extra Large, Animal Crossing. I haven't played Animal Crossing in a hot minute. <laughs> <coughs> I wonder how my village is doing. Sorry, guys. I had to cough. Okay, and then we have... <clears throat> these ones are Hannah Anderson as well. Hannah Anderson Slim Fit. And these ones are a size 5. Size 5 or 110 centimeters, okay? And they're running right now for you guys. Uh, but little Hannah Anderson. This is cute. Um, full of weeds, probably, honestly. Yeah, Kelly, absolutely. Um, I'll show it right after this one for you guys. Okay, let's grab that. This one is, so here's the, where I'm going to break your heart, okay? It doesn't have a lid, so you're going to have to order a replacement lid, and you're going to need to super glue it with some E9000, whatever that's called, the super glue, because it is separated up here. Now, it doesn't affect it. Like, you're still able to drink out of it, but I mean, but it's a Stanley, <laughs> Um, and it's 22, it's a 40 ounce, a 40 ounce Stanley. So I don't, I don't know, but I was like, you know what? This thing hasn't even got to live the full trend itself. So we're going to pick it up. If nobody, if nobody grabs it, I'll fix it myself and then run it for you guys later when I fix it. Um, Mr. $45 Stanley. Okay. And, um, no worries. You're fine. You're fine. Um, thank you for letting her know. I appreciate that. So here we go. Yeah. 45 freaking dollars, you guys. And it's running right now. But like I said, it does, it needs some TLC because of that. Uh, but, but yeah, I still picked it up because I was like, you know what? It's a neutral Stanley. If anything, somebody might want a project, but if you don't want the project, I'm going to try and make it work. <laughs> uh, but, but I just thought it was super cool. But you know, I feel like it's pretty crazy to also be seeing Stanley's already in the rotation at the bins because I feel like the trend just started. So um, next up, this one is Vintage Eddie Bauer. This is so sick, honestly. And I am actually obsessed with it. It's a size large made in the USA and it's 100% cotton. Men's large and it's true vintage. It's a beaut, honestly. Like this would be so cute on 4th of July evening with some high-waisted denim shorts. Oh, that would be so cute, actually. Two seconds left on that one. Kombucha Jones coming in. Eight seconds left. A nice little vintage Eddie Bauer 100% cotton made in the USA sweater. Thank you, Kombucha. That is all yours. Great pickup. Gosh, that's a really nice sweater, though. <laughs> all right. I was thinking about it because we have like the 4th of July. Like, it's pretty big, big event in our area, so I think I'm going to try and do a 4th of July drop for our town. Oh, that'd be so cute. Yes, that would be really cute. I'm also, I love that trend, too, where you put it over and kind of, like, tie it. It looks kind of preppy. It's really cute, though. <laughs> um, okay, this next one is less meanies, more weenies. <laughs> I just love it so much. 100% cotton and it's like an adjustable back on this one as well. A little baseball cap, uh, but running right now. Less meanies, more weenies, okay? Uh, but running right now, adjustable in the bag there. If you've got a Dash Hound lover, this would be the perfect gift for them. Beverly, thank you so much. Four seconds left on that one. Little more weenies, or no, it's less meanies, more weenies. <laughs> Beverly, thank you so much. That is all yours. Great pickup. I thought that was so funny when I found it. I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, and then we have, let's do this sweater next. This one's just been begging to be ran. Size large by Zessica, and it still has like the boutique tag in it. Oh, that'll be perfect, Beverly. Thank you so much. Size large, beautiful, kind of like that burnt orange color. I told you guys I'm obsessed with it right now, and I can't stop finding it. Two seconds, and it's always in the wrong season. <laughs> so this one will be saved for, for the fall time if no one takes it. Okay, and then we have... Let's see, these ones are cut from the cloth, cut from the cloth on these ones. Yes, Velma for sure. Um, and these ones are the boyfriend fit in a size 10. <laughs> he would have been like, excuse me, is that me on the hat? I didn't think so. Four seconds left on this one. Cut from the cloth size um, 10 or a size medium, high-waisted. Google was asking $19.99 on those things. Holy moly. <laughs> All right, next up, you guys, this one is a little vintage Wrangler. 
size extra large vintage wrangler on this one this one's really pretty it's a purple and black combo and it's an extra large i think in kids because there ain't no way that's a men's extra large so kids extra large on this one and it is running right now for you guys um running there we go oh it does not want to it doesn't want to show off itself, but anyways, yes, a Beetlejuice, totally. It kind of reminded me of my favorite Wrangler, and that's why I picked it up. I was like, that's cute. And I've been trying to source another Western show for you guys, so. Oh, okay, these ones are brand new. I don't think these things were ever worn. They're so crispy. Size 4, American Eagle High-Waisted Jegging Fit. Um, they're the highest rise jegging, and they're running right now. Size 4, American Eagle, like new, crispy condition. <laughs> Super high rise on these ones. Nice light wash, perfect for springtime. Two seconds left. All right, those ones were a size um, 4. Size 4, Nicole. I'll keep an eye out for more for you, though, okay? Okay, this next one is... Paxson, or no, this one is not Paxson, sorry, uh, but Deconomy, size small, and it's like a little mushy, but I think it has a little snag. Yeah, it does have like a little snag right here, and it's a size small, so I'll run this one for a dollar just because of that, um, but it's a size small little heathered hoodie, and then it has a little mushroom patch on the front there as well. Two seconds left on that one, size small, and it, I think it has pockets. Yeah, there's a pocket on the front there too. All righty, and then we have... There's no way we're going to get through all of this. There's so much. <laughs> Wait, why are these in here? I don't remember grabbing these. That's really weird. Somebody must have put these in my cart. <laughs> well, I'll run them for a dollar for you guys. Size 2X Terra and Sky. I do not remember finding these though. I'm running great now. 2X Terra and Sky. They're like a fuzzy legging. Yeah, I do not remember these. That's really weird. Two seconds left on these. All right, that doesn't happen very often, but every now and then I think somebody puts stuff in my cart. They're, they're cute. I mean, somebody was shopping for me, I guess. Um, but I don't know, that's weird. <laughs> All right, and then we have Hiva. Hiva, I think is how you say it. No, I thought, I mean, maybe I blacked out, but I mean, I, I thought I remembered my trip. All right, this one was Hiva Kid Size 5. It's like a nice, thicker shacket, and it is running right now for you guys. Kid Size 5, I mean, who knows, honestly. Maybe I do black out, and I'm just not aware of it. <laughs> it's probably what it is, honestly. I'm probably just, like, full-on blacking out, and I'm just putting stuff in my cart, and then I'm like, oh, yeah, that's a great find. <laughs> Thank you so much, Danny. That is all yours. Oh, yeah. I, you know, I, I honestly don't put it past myself. It's a Monday morning. I probably did pick it up and then just forgot about it completely. Okay. This is another one that was supposed to be pulled. So if anybody wants it, I will break your heart. Um, it's a mint medium made in the USA. Beautiful. Granola girl moment right here. It's a mint medium, but would easily fit a size, I would say, like, um probably like a large, maybe XL. I will run this one if anybody wants it today, I'll run it for 12. So if anybody wants it, I will run it for 12 and I'll run it right now just in case. It's absolutely stunning. It was, it's supposed to go in my storefront, but like I said, you guys get first dibs. So um, running right now, isn't it beautiful though? And it's a men's medium. I would say that it would fit a size large, possibly XL, depending on how you want it to fit. Thank you, Cheyenne. I really appreciate you. Thank you. Isn't that gorgeous? A dream find. No, literally. And that's what I found. I was like, Oh my gosh. <laughs> Thank you, Cheyenne. I really appreciate it. That is all yours. There's, we're about to hit a sweater patch and your guys' jaws are going to be on the ground because they are so pretty. <laughs> Thank you again, Cheyenne. Yeah, it literally was though. I found that and I was like, are you kidding me? Okay, here's another sweater. This one I think is a little mushroom. I, no, I don't think it's a mushroom. What is this? What is that? What did I grab? Okay, maybe I did black out today. Of course. Thank you so much, Cheyenne. I appreciate you. Oh, no, it's the Grim Reaper. You guys are right. I see it now. Or a ninja, huh? No, I see it because he's got his, like, blades right here. <laughs> maybe I did black out. <laughs> this is sick. Size medium. It's cropped, too. It's kind of, like, goth, but, like, cute. Make it cute goth. <laughs> uh, but maybe I did black out. <laughs> I did pull off my Benjamin, so who knows? Here we go, running right now, size medium, and it's really stretchy, it's super soft as well. Uh, but it's a little Grim Reaper, uh, a little cutie Grim Reaper. I feel like I'd wear this to Easter, just to, just to confuse my family. Zancor for sure, honestly. <laughs> Thank you so much, Zan, that is all yours. I'm glad you like that one. Oh, I, I literally thought it was a mushroom, so that's hilarious. <laughs> I was like, that's an aggressive mushroom, but I'll, I'll, run, I'll dig it. <laughs> okay, and then let's see, I think there's more sweaters in here. 
let's see. This one is, I think this is a little jumpsuit. Size large by Mimi Chica. But the graphic means business. No, literally, that's what I was gonna say. It's, it's like it's like it's like goth, but like cute goth. I don't know how to explain that. A size large on this one, and I think it's a romper. This is one of those ones that they always get me. They trick me. Oh, it's a romper. Okay, this one's a romper. Oh, why did I not keep this for myself? This is cute. Has pockets on both sides of it. It's fully smocked at the top here. It is tagged to size large. I I would I don't think this would fit my chest. Um, I think this is gonna be more of a medium. Pastel buff. <laughs> and it's running right now. If anybody wants it, I would say more of a medium, but it is a little Mimi Chica is the brand and it's a wide leg jumpsuit. It's really cute. It reminds me of the jumpsuit that I have actually that has kind of like that asymmetrical hem to it and it's very flowy. Um I was gonna say maybe like a like a medium if you have a smaller chest. I mean it would probably work fine because it's very stretchy. It's all smocked at the top. Um but yeah, it's a romper. Thank you, Kay. That is all yours that is so cute it's gonna be nice and lightweight for the summertime though thank you thank you number 28 okay and then we have let's see i'm just gonna keep digging through this one honestly and then we'll just make our way through the other ones as well i'm gonna bring it closer what else we got in here what other goods we got Gap denim size small for kids. Gap denim small for kids, and it's like a denim full length um overalls running right now. Kids size small full length overalls by Gap for kids. Um, it does not say it just says Gap kids on it. How would you tell with the boys or girls? Is there a way to know for overalls? I'm not sure actually. I think they're unisex, maybe. Let me see if it says on the tag. It just says size small, six, seven. So let me know if you want me to rerun those. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm not very informative for you. Next up, it's 100% silk, if I remember right. Yeah, 100% silk men's medium. And this one is like a little green button up. I love these little button ups with shorts in the summertime. So I will always pick them up size medium and men's and it's hundred percent silk and a beautiful kind of like olivey green. And then it has these little cream details to it as well. Two seconds left on that one. Hi Jen, welcome in everybody. Okay. And then we have, let's see, I see a Grinch thing. The, the, the Grinch. This one will be stored for Christmas if no one takes it today. Grinch size 4T. 4T on that one running right now. And it says define naughty. <laughs> That's cute though. Size 4T. <clears throat> Alrighty. And then we have, oh, my pile's kind of leaning. Oh, this is a big sweater. This one is Zara. This one's sick. I know I need that one in an adult too. That one's really pretty. Let's see. Zara size. It's a chunky sweater. Size medium. Let me get it on a hanger. Maybe that'll give it some shape. This is a big sweater. <laughs> this is a really chunky knit. It's tagged a medium. I would say you could probably get a large in this. No problem. Um, really heavyweight, nice, cozy, chunky knit um, Zara sweater. And it's tagged a medium color blocked as well. And then it has this big cowl neck on it, tagged a medium. And then it has that cable knit coming up it as well. Two seconds left. Ray, thank you so much. That is all yours. Yeah, that is really pretty. And that's going to be so freaking warm. Thank you so much, Ray. Okay, and then we have... I know there's another sweater in here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is what I was looking for. You guys like the other one. Wait until you see this one. <laughs> I was super excited for this one. This one is crossings, vintage crossings. It's hundred percent cotton and a size large. Oh, this one is so pretty. So this one, it's going to be a $15 start. Um, and I'll start with that. So I don't break your guys' hearts too much more. Um, and it did have a little spot on it, but I'm going to have a hard time finding it. Oh, it's up here. There was a little teeny bit of discoloration in the collar. And just like throughout the piece, there is like a little bit of discoloration and just because of the age itself as well. It is a size large. I will run this one right now. It is a large in men's. I would say it's pretty true to a size for women's large as well possibly extra large if you wanted a tighter fit and it's running just for 15 if anybody wants that but vintage beautiful it's like it's grandpa core but like 
make it like past up. <laughs> um, it's just so pretty. I was very excited to find that one. So, and that one's going in my storefront. So I'm very excited to have that on my racks. I think they're going to really like that one. And I'm going to put it over there too. So I don't forget. Okay. And then we have, let's see, this one's a little graphic tee size medium. Oh, that'd be so cute. Size medium on this one. And it says, it's got a little daisy with a smiley face and it says, have a good day. And it's by the brand Chemistry, size medium on that one. I think you see. And see, I'm still, um, oh wait, maybe it was, was it you that requested the, the knit tank tops? Now I'm trying to remember who it was. I know somebody requested and yes, okay. I, we are still digging and I have not found them yet, but there are three to four in here. And I don't know why, how we have not found a single one of them. Thank you, C. I appreciate you. Um, but, but you do have first dibs and I wanted to make sure you knew that. Um, I'm not just like digging through here. <laughs> I am trying to find them as I go through it, but so far, I'm actually shocked that we have not found them. Okay. One bin rolled out and a teacher broke him up to me. He's like, Hey, you need to go dig through that bin. If you like Y2K. And I was like, well, I don't really know a lot about Y2K. And so I went and dug and I found a few pieces, but he had like a cart full of Y2K. And he was like, yeah, I'm gonna put it on my Depop. And I was like, that's cool. Which I was like, cool. <laughs> um, but yeah, here we go. This one is Barbie core to the max. It only has three buttons. So it's like an open front. It's pleated. It's so like groovy. Um, and it, let's see, the Goodwill tagged it for extra large. Let's see if, if it is a true Y2K. I don't know if it is true. It looks like it though. It's tagged to extra large, I guess. Extra large. So I would say probably like a large extra large. Um, and it does have a lot of stretch and then it has a bell sleeve to it as well. But this would be so cute with some high-waisted denim for the springtime with that hot pink. Very much like a Barbie core, but like business Barbie. <laughs> okay. And then let's see, we got a, another sweater. Oh, this one is, wait for it. Wait for it. I was actually shocked by the brand of this one too. This one is universal threads in a size large and look how freaking pretty it is. Chunky, chunky knit sweater. And it is like a really pretty, like pastel knit to it here. And I'm going to pin a giveaway because I forgot to warm them over here. Sorry. I meant to, I keep meaning to do them at the hour mark, but then I get distracted by my hiccups and running right now. Maybe that's what I'll remind myself. Every time I hiccup, I give you guys a giveaway. <laughs> Size large, running right now, chunky, chunky knit, universal thread, spring knit kind of color palette as well. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I hiccup. Sorry. Here's your giveaway. <laughs> Literally perfect for Easter. I don't know if I can guarantee it's going to get to you in time, but beautiful piece. Fluffy, thank you so much for your first purchase. Welcome to the Swan Squad. You're like, I can vouch. I have this in multiple colors and it is my favorite. Yeah, it's a cutie. So I am really excited. I found that one with the ribbon that is in it. And you were right in the camera. No, I am so glad you thought the same thing. Isn't it beautiful? Like, and it literally is like intertwined with ribbon. It's so pretty. Um, I can do a little Y2K piece. Yeah, they're so soft. This one is um by the brand and hot kiss and I'm gonna say this is like a small medium Let me see if it says down here oh just kidding it is tagged an extra large I would say like a medium large maybe running right now medium large maybe and it's by hot kiss a nice little kind of like cobalt blue color four seconds left on that one okay and then we have let's see oh this one is really pretty so I wouldn't have picked this up normally but I picked it up because it was plus size and it is like a style that you guys really like it's by Cotton Express it does have some discoloration to it I think this would be really pretty dyed like a magenta color or like blended with the white maybe um size 2xl and it is a tiered fairy like skirt I'm just gonna run it for a dollar I want somebody to have this in their closet because I just think it is so pretty tagged to 2x it is I believe 100% cotton it does have discoloration in the waistband there it's a mid length so it's gonna hit like mid shin size 2 on that one. All right. And really pretty piece. So I was just excited for it. So I might try um, treating it myself as well, honestly. Let's see. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's like a little bag. It's like, what is this? A little crossbody bag, kind of like a hippie inspired piece. It has little sunshines on it. And then I think those are little giraffes. Um, are they two headed giraffes? No, I see they've got two bodies. Um, anyways, running right now, little crossbody style. It has a button closure to it. These are always sold at the fairs and I always think they're so freaking cute. And then I never buy one and I regret it every time. <laughs> Thank you so much, Cheyenne. Two seconds left on that one. Little crossbody. And I think it does have a pocket on the inside of it as well. 
yeah, there's pockets on the inside and then it does have the full crossbody and then it does button closed as well. Um, <laughs> Sage, you're all good. We didn't, we didn't miss much. Thank you so much, McKenna. That is all yours. Missed a few cute sweaters. <laughs> Number 32. I hope you had a nice nap though. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it, McKenna. Okay. And then we have, let's see. This one's a two pack of bras. So I'll run them both together for you guys. There's a little gray underwire no lining and then there's the matching little nude one so you get the nude one <laughs> sorry sage i know there's more sweaters coming though and then i'm trying to get them to go together there you go so two bras both the same style and they're by the brand montel intimates and they're tagged a size 34b 34B bundle of bras. You get a nude one and then you also are going to get a charcoal gray one and they have no lining. They just have the underwire to them. Thank you, Katie. I appreciate it. Yeah, these ones are cute though. I wish they were my size because I've been looking for some like little uh, lacy bras for in the summertime. Thank you. I appreciate it, Katie. Those are all yours. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Number 33. I'm glad you guys are enjoying this. I wasn't sure if you guys still like this kind of format, so it's been fun. Yes, of course. Thank you. Okay, and then this next one is a medium. Oh, this one is cute. I have a few of these that I pull out in the summertime, and they're my favorites. This is by Cherry Sticks, and it is a little romper. How freaking cute is that? Has pockets, and then it is a size medium. Sweetheart neckline to it as well. Um, I'm glad you guys are liking it. Size medium, and it's a romper. So it's true vintage, little romper, size medium. This is going to look so cute with some little um, converse, like high waist, um, high converse, you know what I'm talking about. And it is a romper. Pockets on both sides. See, that is so freaking cute. Thank you so much. So cute. <laughs> okay, and then we have, let's see. I think this is a little mushroom piece. No boundaries, size extra large. Oh, thank you, Hannah. I appreciate that. Thank you. I actually, I dealt with some mean girls today. I didn't tell you guys about that. Some girls at the bins were making fun of me because I had so much in my cart. Like they were talking shit about me at the bins and they were like, <laughs> the best part though is that they were like wearing gloves. Um, oh, really? Oh my gosh, that's hilarious, Katie. Um, that was so long ago. <laughs> But yeah, they were literally, Zeus, no more. Anyway, sorry, there's a post office person out front. But yeah, literally the girls, girls were making fun of me. And as they were making fun of me, they were like, how does she even find that much stuff? There's no way she's finding that much good stuff. And then they literally were wearing gloves and like they would like touch things and they were like, how is she finding anything good? This is all so gross. And then like their mom was with them and she was also like being like rude and like commenting on my cart and stuff. And I was like, and then I realized it was spring break. <laughs> so everybody's on spring break apparently. And they decided to go to the bins, but just like these random girls that had to have been like freshmen in college, like they were so young and they were just like full on bashing me for having a full cart of the bins. And I was just like, is this all you have? Like, this is all you can do if like, what? <laughs> No, right? And that's like, it's, it's so funny because so many times people go to the bins like that and they'll just talk mad shit about like me, like having a full cart. And it's most of the time they're just mad because they cannot find stuff that they want. <laughs> they're drinking haterade, but no, and literally, and that's, I think what it is, is they're just jealous. And then like my favorite too, is they'll be like, how did you even find that much stuff? And I'm like, oh, I've been here since opening. And they're like, oh, and they literally got there like five minutes ago. So it's like, it's so funny to me because you can just tell it's like the jealousy just like comes out with it. Uh, but found another Lululemon, <laughs> right? No, and honestly, that's like what you guys start doing at some point, right? You really got to start muscles with them. <laughs> that's when you go through the bins that they just got done going through and you go, oh my gosh, how did you pass this? <laughs> Right, I know exactly, and for no reason too, because <laughs> I looked <laughs> literally. Yeah, exactly, exactly, and it's so funny too because like all the workers are always like, "Yeah, keep piling it on," and it's always the customers that are like, <laughs> "Oh, I'm doing a whole bin of new with tags. Oh, it's already in my cart. Sorry." <laughs> No boundaries. This one was an extra large. It's just a little mushroom button up. I just thought that was so cute. Uh, but ready great right now. It's size extra large, no boundaries. But yeah, I just was like, what the heck? And it's it's honestly, I get it though. Like for some people that go to the bins that are strictly resellers, um, that are like looking for things that are worth a lot of money, like 
free people, Lululemon. And you guys know that is not something I find like on the regular. Like if I find Lululemon, I'm like, oh my gosh, I found Lululemon in the bins. <laughs> So it's like, I think the issue is that there's just different types of expectations when you go to the bins. And I, being a secondhand seller, not so much just a reseller, it, I, it's like, it, I think there's a difference. I don't know. I think there is. Um, but I look more on the sustainability focus of it, of like, is this a style that people would like? Is this a trend right now? Instead of just, oh, this is a good brand and it probably could sell for 50 bucks, you know? So um, I'd be like, are you mad at all the good stuff that's in my car? Yeah, literally. <laughs> Um, if you like what I found, here's my show. <laughs> That'd be so funny, Sarah. I'm like, here, since you're already being petty, here's my business card. And you want to come judge me some more, come to my show. <laughs> um, talking with your hands. <laughs> the cat's like, ooh. <laughs> um, okay, this one, actually, you know what? Bookmark my show. <laughs> this, um, this one is brand new with the tags, actually. And I don't, I don't, I'll read it for you guys if you guys want it. It's new with tags from Aerie. I was going to put it into the Christmas box for next year, but if somebody wants to hold on to it now, or you are having snow right now, here you go. This is a little um, Aerie blanket. And then on it says, on the side right here, it says just chill. And then it has the big pom poms as well. And it's brand new with the tags. Yeah. <laughs> Hannah, that's such a good one. It's so funny though, because I can be all witty right now, right? Um, <laughs> snow, what's that? Um, I can be witty right now and I can be like, mm. But the moment that it's like in person and people are doing that to me, I'm always like, me? <laughs> I hate confrontation. I know, right? Just chill. I'm trying to find the tag again. Oh, there it is. Um, Airy new with tags on that one, you guys. And it is running right now for you guys. And it says, just chill on the side. This is actually going to be so cute with like a little trench coat when it gets cold again. And unless it's still cold where you guys are. <laughs> uh, but, but no, I'm so, I'm so bad at like confrontation that my comebacks just are not there. Um, I have comebacks for days. I wish I was there because I would have been <laughs> Thank you so much. See, this is why I have friends that are good at comebacks. <laughs> Thank you, Katie. I appreciate you. Uh, but that's literally though, because <laughs> I'm so bad at it. <laughs> That'll be so sweet, Katie. Oh my gosh, that's such a good idea. Thank you. That's really sweet. They're gonna love that too. You know, some teacher is gonna eat that up. <laughs> Okay, let's do this little Ralph Lauren next because this thing is adorable. It's a little pleated skirt and it's Ralph Lauren, uh, but Ralph Lauren polo on the back there because I clap back and forget where I am. <laughs> You're like, I have way too much sass to be dishing, dishing out. <laughs> Adjustable waistband here and this one is a size 6 Ralph Lauren um, and it is running right now for you guys. Size 6 in girls. I was at the thrift store today and didn't realize they were closing. Turned the lights off 30 minutes early to keep doing and kept doing a cat. Oh my gosh! 30 minutes early too? I would have just kept shopping. I would have been like, sorry, I've got 30 more minutes. <laughs> Oh my goodness. That's funny. I, okay. I've been in a restaurant where that happened before where they, we, we got there like two and a half hours before and we were catching up. So we were talking a lot and I get that that's probably annoying because I was a waitress. Right. Um, but yeah, a restaurant 30 minutes before they're closing, they turned off the lights on us and we're like, basically like turning off the music. And then we watched like the server that was serving us just leave. She left her shift 30 minutes before they were closed. And we were all like, it's the most awkward thing ever but like and then we, at that point we were petty we were like like we we're like you can have our dishes but we're gonna sit here <laughs> i don't know why you're being like this <laughs> uh, but this next one is a size extra small in kids it's just a little orange tea extra small actually i think it has a spot in it too maybe this was an accident we'll just put that to the side i think i picked that up with a kids bundle that i had found um, I never would speak up until I watched people get mistreated one too many times and now I jump on people's defense. I appreciate that so much, Hannah. I, I respect people like you, honestly. Hi, Carly. How are you? Okay. Oops. There we go. This one is Prana. It needs washed. And I, I don't know. I wasn't going to show this one to you guys because I was going to wash it first, but I'll, I'll run it if anybody wants it. Um, it's a size medium Prana sports bra. There we go. Prana sports bra. I'm pretty sure pretty sure that's deodorant. I'll run it for a dollar though. So size medium prana and we'll just run it for a dollar because it needs to be washed. There we go. When they found me, I was like, wait, <laughs> wait, 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 I missed something. I got locked in a store before they didn't see me and never did. They never did an announcement. <laughs> Alicia, thank you for your first purchase. Welcome to the Swan Squad. Oh my gosh, Sarah, I would cry. <laughs> I fly off the handle really fast. <laughs> see, okay. Yeah, I mean, I was gonna say that I can if I needed to. 
I guess I do. Like I, I would say I put my foot down when I need to, but I definitely don't do it in like a very um like smooth way. <laughs> uh, but it was all these. So <laughs> you're like, that's fine. I'll just eat your groceries all night. <laughs> Uh, but next up, you guys, this one is a little vintage. I always see those, uh, like, Mr. Beast competitions, you know what I'm talking about, where they, like, lock somebody in a, um, a grocery store, and they have to, like, eat what they have in there. Man, I could last for so long. How much you paying me? <laughs> I'm really nice and just can't stand the mean girl energy, so I'll definitely go into defense mode if I need to. Yeah, and maybe that's what it is, is this is some mean girl energy that really kind of just, like, gets me. Like, I'm like, why? Why are you being like that? Like, is that really, like, what you want to spend your time on this earth doing? <laughs> Uh, but this next one, you guys, this is so cute. It's a little tie cardigan. It does have some wear to it. It's it's true vintage, I'm pretty sure. Um, it's by the brand, or not vintage, Y2K, which I guess technically is vintage, right? It's by the brand Anxiety. And this one is um, no size tag. It's kind of faded. I would say like a size small medium. Small medium on that one running right now. And then it ties at the front there. And it's like a little crochet cardigan. Hi, Arden. Oh, you're okay. We're still we're just hanging out today. We're going through all the bags and you can claim something if, something if you like it. Bovita, thank you so much. That is all yours. And thank you for your first purchase. Welcome to the Swat Squad. Okay, and then this one is a little Ralph Lauren. Say six months. And it's a little teddy bear onesie. This one's so cute. <clears throat> little teddy bear onesie. And it is size six months running right now for you guys. There we go. Little teddy bear Ralph Lauren onesie. And it's a full snap up as well. I just can't stand the mean girl. Oh, wait, I, I just read that again. Sorry. I was like, wait, did I miss something? Um, yeah, it was, it shocked me though. Cause usually that's not the case. Like they're not like so blatantly rude about it. Like usually they'll be very subtle and they'll like point at me and I'll see them pointing at me. But like today they were just like full on standing next to me being like, ew. <laughs> and I was like, what the, what, why? <laughs> Nike size six months. Nike six months on this one. It's a little onesie for kiddos with the little feet. And then it has the Nike symbol in the back there as well. Four seconds left on that one. Nike size six months. All right. And then we have, oh, the pile's huge. Uh, let's see. I mean, I got like a few more in here. Oh, I found the sweater in the hat that I've been looking for. See, if I don't get to your, your tank tops, I'm going to message you and I'll miss, um, we'll figure it out tonight, okay? Um, American Eagle, size extra large. This is what I was trying to tell you guys I found today and I was so excited because I think you guys would like this one. Size extra large. I know it's so cute too. It's literally the perfect spring sweater. Like spring evenings with this on is going to be so cozy. American Eagle and it is a size making sure extra large, extra large on this one. Uh, but just find something really nice and hold it up and say, score, yeah, literally. <laughs> uh, but it's so cute. I love this color too. It's kind of like a coral color. It's like a muted coral, extra large running right now. And it's American Eagle. It has a big pocket in the front as well. This looks so cozy, true to size. And I would say maybe a little bit boxy for an extra large. Thank you, Sage. Four seconds left on that one. A cute little coral American Eagle hoodie. Let us express. I love your username. That is so cute. Five seconds left on this one. American Eagle size extra large. All right. Let us express. Thank you for your first purchase. Oh my gosh. And your profile picture is so cute. Thank you. Welcome to the Swan Squad. Oh, American Eagle in general, I swear by it. You know, it can go out of trend all at once, but I freaking love American Eagle. I love their jegging jeans. I love it all. <laughs> I will forever be an American Eagle girly. And I think it's because I never had it growing up because we couldn't afford it. And now that I get it all secondhand, I love it. <laughs> uh, but this next one is organic cotton in the size extra small. It's just a really cute piece. It's like an earthy colored ruffle blouse organic cotton from Dip in a size extra small. And it's very lightweight and airy. This is actually so cute. Um, right <laughs> you're like i'm just gonna go browse <laughs> yeah same here same with like airy too i just i love those brands for some reason i think it's just because it's like it's a comfort brand for me like i find it really cozy okay let's do some blush and then some random pulls as well for you guys um i have not worn their jeans since high school and i've not tried them since are they good for curvy I think so. <laughs> I, I would say yes, because they're so stretchy, um, especially when they have a tag underneath American Eagle that says stretch. And I was just going to say, they also have a curvy line. So good. I don't have curves, so I can't like completely vouch for it. But I honestly feel like I think it fits my hips better because it's like so stretchy and it holds too. Like sometimes stretchy jeans don't hold. 
I think they hold better. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I swear by my American Eagle jeans. Yeah. And, and see, that was me too, is jeans are just hard for me to find. And the only one that I consistently can find and be like, this is so comfortable. I can wear these every day are literally my American Eagles. <laughs> um, but yeah, I was wearing them today and didn't feel like I was wearing jeans. Exactly. Yeah. If you get the 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 high rise jeggings are what i have and i think i have them in like every color possible because they're just so comfy and their jeggings are the ones that are super super stretchy i buried it. i was gonna try and show you the tag of the one i was talking about but anyways <laughs> but yeah i would i would always recommend trying them if you let me know your size i can also try and find your size for you guys yeah seven jeans is another good one they've got a good stretch too yeah no sarah literally <laughs> i've got no butt <laughs> they make my butt look nice and big <laughs> Um, I've got, I've always had a flat butt though. This one is Thai Beanie Babies, 1999. It's a little dinosaur, um, but 1999 little dino beanie baby running right now. He's like an earthy toad as well. He's so cute. <laughs> I love finding the little vintage beanie babies. Um, but yeah, I, I will always look for jeans for you guys. If you are ever looking for a lot of like denim options, thank you, Danny. You guys, um, should probably don't donate, but you should probably, um, go bookmark my, boho coastal show because that's where i usually have the most in them um uh, thank you yes of course i'm glad you like him he was a cutie um let's do this little set right here because this is another cute little spring set oh where'd the pants go well just kidding there's pants to this piece we'll have to come back <laughs> i don't know where the pants went um for seven jeans. Okay, I did just pick up some seven jeans today. They'll be in the Boho Coastal for sure then. Uh, but Forever 21 for kids in a size 13, 14. Yeah, um, I actually do do personal shopping. Um, I don't really advertise it as much as I used to just because I've kind of left that format, but I do offer it. Um, I would say it's a little bit more spinny than your normal average of a personal curated um, bundle, but I do like take my time to really put them together. But yeah, if you are ever interested, feel free to DM me. It's on my site underneath like bundles um curated thrift bundles is what i think it's under size 13 14 and kids little tiered dress forever 21 on this one this is really cute i wish this was adult sizing because that is adorable and it does have pockets as well 15 14 two seconds left but yeah i do do personal shopping and i do take requests as well so like if you guys ever have like an open request or something i will try and like source that for you um i'm just a little bit more slower on that process <laughs> uh, but, but yeah anyways next up is carhartt size medium and this one is a medium in men's it's a really nice like rusty thermal and then it has a zipper pocket on the side right here carhartt size medium and it's running right now for you guys there we go nice little carhartt kind of like a rusty red color and then it has that pocket on the side um and i would say it's a medium yeah i think it's a medium in men's because it's gonna fit like a size large in women's on that one but yeah nice and long sleeve and it's got a really good texture as well thank you katie that is all yours thank you thank you all right and number 41 or number 40 wait what just happened did i put a sticker on something without what what did i do sorry one sec guys i'm trying to figure out what i did okay i'm gonna come back to this card making a mental note for myself really quick. One sec. I think one of my numbers registered, but it didn't register in the store. Thank you, Katie. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. So that I think I fixed it though. I should be able to catch up and figure that out. I'm going to put a little, so I know to check that. Okay. There we go. Okay. Anyways, <laughs> continuing, let's go ahead and do another plush for you guys. This one is a Disney plush. Um, and this one's just gonna be a dollar start cause he needs wash, but it is Disney Pixar. <laughs> and I forgot his name again. Was it, is it for Forky? We just talked about him too. But yeah, little Forky. Um, and I honestly don't know if this is supposed to be on here or if a kiddo drew on him or not, but he does have a lot of wear to him. So like I said, we're just gonna do him for a dollar, but I just thought he was so freaky, so like a freaky funny. <laughs> uh, but he's running right now for you guys. Little Forky, he's got wire in his hands as well. Oh, okay, okay, so that is how it's supposed to be, you guys. I didn't know, and that's why I was like, I'll just run it for a dollar just in case. But yeah, little Forky. <laughs> And I know somebody was asking for Toy Story in my Disney show, so that's why I was like, oh, I'll grab that. Okay, next up is a little knit kind of like sweater tee. This one is really cute. It is um, by the brand Willow and Clay. 
and it doesn't have a size tag on it. I'm going to say it's like a size medium. Willow and Clay, it's a really pretty knit sweater, and I would say like a size medium. Running right now, beautiful charcoal gray, and then it has a nice like open knit style to it. Very lightweight on this one as well. Two seconds left on that. All right, and then we have, oh, Arden, thank you. <laughs> I saw that at the last second. Thank you so much, Arden. I appreciate it. That is all yours. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to get it in the hanger really quick. Oh, thank you for your first purchase. Welcome to the Swan Squad. Thank you, thank you. Okay, and then we have, let's see, let's do the Pokemon next. This one is a Pokemon kid size large. Thank you. And let's see, kid size large Pokemon tee up next, and it is running right now. And this one has little Pikachu, and then it has all the other little Pokemons on there as well. Size large. Two seconds left on that one. Old Navy. Old Navy has such soft tees. Alrighty, and then next up, oops, I'm still looking for that B PJ set um, <laughs> from the last show, but it wouldn't let me, oh, oh no, Arden, that sucks, I'm so sorry, it's been having a lot of issues like that recently, I don't know why, this next one is going to be a, um, best for like a size medium, it's a little denim button up, and then it has like the little spring scene on it, it's so cute, and running Ooh, pick up right now, <laughs> um, little garden scene button up, and it's going to be a size medium. All right, and next up, I forgot that I left that poll up for you guys, but I'm glad you guys have been responding. Thank you. It's actually really helpful information. <laughs> I'm going to keep that in mind. <clears throat> okay, I have two pieces now that I'm looking for bottoms for. I'm going to put it to the side, and I guess I'll come back in a little bit. <laughs> um, it's like the one downside of, like, finding sets is, like, I need to, like, rubber band them together or something. Okay, this next one is Gap, and it's a size medium petite. I would say it'll fit a size medium fine. It is a really pretty home, like, house robe, long sleeve, and it's, like, a really nice, kind of, like, an off green color. Um, Yes, there is a purse. I'll pull it and do that purse next after this. It's, like, kind of a gothic theme. So this one is... Is it a robe or is it a dress? I think it's a dress, actually. Oh, it totally is. <laughs> this is a wrap dress. So it's another little wrap dress, you guys. Oh my goodness, I told you guys, these wrap dresses throw me off every time. Um, so it's a size medium petite um, by the brand Gap, but I would say this is going to fit a medium fine, and it is running right now for you guys. Um, I would say it's like very minimal sheer. And I think that if you wore a little tank top or a slip under this, you should be fine. And running right now, size medium petite gap. And it's like a really pretty kind of like aqua green color, full wrap dress. So it's a true wrap style, very stretchy as well. Two seconds left on that one. But yeah, definitely not doing it justice on the hanger. <laughs> uh, but let me know if you guys change your mind on that one. Okay, and then next up, this one is a kid's my, my, uh, my another story oh this is cute <laughs> this is really cute let me see if i can find the size tag a hundred centimeters there we go my another story running right now for you guys that's cute though it's a little plaid long sleeve dress i think this will go to the storefront if no one grabs it it's a cutie. I'm going to try and have like one kid's rack, I think, set up. Okay, the goth bag was... Oh, it's down here. Okay. Next, that did not work how I, how I planned for that to work at all. But the good news is, is I found the hat that I was trying to get for you guys as well. So, perfect. Um, there's a goth bag. Graceful dump. Thank you. Thank you. It literally missed everything possible uh, that I was trying to do. <laughs> so, this next one is a little denim bag. I, I think this fits, like, the goth idea. It has adjustable straps. It has little stars on it. And then it, I don't think it had a tag. Let me see, though. Little tag right here. Let's see if it says... Nope, no tag, but it does have a little snap closure and then it does have a pocket on the inside as well. Adjustable strap on this one. Um, actually, no adjustable strap. So it's just a little, um, cro a little, what's that called? Shoulder bag, my goodness. I just lost all train of thought. 
<laughs> yeah, I, I think the, the Taco Bell hat was definitely throwing me off because somebody tell me why. This is the swaggiest thing I've ever found. <laughs> this is a Taco Bell embroidered bucket hat. It does have some wear in the band here, but honestly, a gym. Literally, Zan said it best, a gym. <laughs> Uh, and it is embroidered Taco Bell, Port Authority, size small, medium. It's tight on me, but I think it's fine. It's actually really cute. Um, I almost kept this for myself as well. Here we go. Let's run it right now for you guys. But little denim Taco Bell bucket hat and it's embroidered. So cute. <laughs> Arden. I'll keep an eye out for more like this. I just thought that was so fun. We got a little denim 100% cotton Taco Bell hat. Thank you, Erica. Oh, Erica's coming at the last second too. Thank you so much. That one's going to be number 42. Thank you. We got three seconds left and I think Erica's taking it. Thank you. Thank you, Erica. Oh, that's so fun. <laughs> I was so excited when I found it. Okay, and then let's do this one next. This is on the top. This one does have some spots on it, so we'll run it for five. Um, it's vintage Nautica. And it is a size small. Um, and then there is just little tiny yellow spots, just like that, throughout the piece. Um, and it's running right now for you guys. Tagged as small in men's, so it will fit like a size medium in women's. Very much like a coastal core to this one as well. Two seconds left on that one. Alrighty, little grandpa core moment. <laughs> um, okay, let's do this Burt's Bees Max. So nice Burt's Bees, nice little onesie. 24 months on this one. This one's really cute. <laughs> 24 months onesie and it is a, a zip down feature as well. So 24 months on this one, Burt's Bees, and it is running right now for you guys. There we go. Nice little Burt's Bees full zip onesie and it is a zip down style. Burt's Bees 24 months on this one. I hope I had another Burt's Bees onesie in here too. Thank you, Katie. 24 months. Katie, it was like your lucky day today. <laughs> Anna's going to get a whole new bundle. Thank you so much, Katie. I appreciate it. That is all yours. All right. And that one's number 43. I know. Yeah, I really, I usually don't find as much kid stuff as I have, but the last two trips I have done, I have found just oodles amounts of kids clothing. And it's not like it's just like simple kids clothing either. Whoops, that one needs to be pulled. Um, it's not like it's simple kids clothing either. It's literally all um, like boutique, like Zara, Madewell, or not Madewell. Um, why am I blanking on all the kids? Like Burt's Bees, literally just finding that like crazy, the Bowdoin. I never find as much Bowdoin as I have recently. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> I feel like Goodwill did something different with their, their sorting systems. 140 centimeters on this next one. So let's see, that's going to be... 40. 40? 40, I think. Someone correct me if I'm wrong, though. I really got to download a size chart for myself. Let me get them fixed so that they are a little more even for you guys as well. Okay, there we go. 140 centimeters. It's a little pair of short alls, and they're kind of like an acid wash to them as well. Let me pull up the chart. Now I got to look. Hannah Anderson size chart. My computer already knows. It's like, this is what you're looking for. Um, 140. Oh, size 10? That doesn't seem right. Let me try the baby toddler sizes. Oh, maybe it is. Size 10? I don't think that's right. I'm going to say like a kid's small, honestly. Kid's small. Um, <laughs> I don't think that these are a, a kid size 10 because that would mean that they're like a size medium, right? Um, two seconds left on those ones. They do have some stretch to them as well. Thank you, Lily. I appreciate it. They're super cute and they're going to be perfect as we go into the warmer seasons. Thank you, Lily. Those are all yours. Great pickup. And those ones are going to be number 44. Let me close this size chart over here too. There we go. Thank you. Number 44. Okay, and then we have... See you, Oh, this is a nice one. This is a little activewear dress from Luga or Luga. Luga? Luga? <laughs> um, it has a built-in sports bra. I almost kept this one for myself too. Um, built-in sports bra and then it has adjustable straps that cross over in the back and then I believe... Yeah, it is basically a Holara dress. So it has the shorts built into the bottom of it as well little biker shorts as well. So it's a one piece with the dress over the top and a size large. And it is like really nice black 
active wear dress. There we go. Size large on this one. And then it does have the built-in spandex underneath it. So you are not going to flash anybody. Um, nice little workout dress, size large. And it's all black. Really cute though. And it was by the brand Lugga. And it's really good quality too. It's very thick and it feels like Lulu, honestly. Yeah, this is going to be a really good staple, especially in the summertime for like little walks. You can pair your little tennis shoes with it and you're good to go. Or if you've got like a park day, you're going to like the zoo or something. Thank you, Sage. That is all yours. I really wanted to go to the zoo recently. <laughs> Thank you, Sage. That's a really cute piece though. Yeah, I almost kept it, so I'm glad somebody took it. Because <laughs> I probably would have pulled it after this if not. Okay, and then let's go ahead and do this one because this is really pretty. This one is a little pink corset style and it's a size small. This one's really cute though. There we go. Size small, little baby pink, and it is running right now for you guys. Um, oh, I know. You can't go wrong with a black dress, honestly. <laughs> Size small, adjustable straps as well. Two seconds left on that one. It looks like the Dolls Kills piece I found a while back. I don't know if you guys remember that one. Okay, and then we have, oh, these are so cute. These ones are Bobo Chose, Chooses, Choses. I'm butchering that one size 12 to 18 months and they're little geometrical sweatpants 12 to 18 months and they are running right now for you guys and then they do have a little pocket in the back here as well and they've got a good stretch to them 12 to 18 months on those ones thank you kombucha these are so cute i'm a sucker for the primary color stuff especially when it's like a muted primary color two seconds left kombucha thank you so much those are all yours i haven't actually heard of this brand have you guys heard of it bobo Choses? I don't, I don't know. I've never heard of it. Um, and I found several pieces by it as well. Thank you, Kombucha. Yeah, I was gonna say they're really cute. And there's some other pieces too that were super cute. And I was just like, what? I would never heard of this brand. <laughs> That's what I was talking about though. As I, as I start kind of looking for more kid stuff for myself and like our future, I feel like I'm going to like really learn a lot. <laughs> Denim in the box. This is another one. Thank you, Zan. I appreciate that because I totally would have just kept going by. Thank you. This one is Denim in the box. They sell for a lot. No way. Well, hey, you just got a deal. <laughs> um, I don't know what this is in reference to. It says, hello, chips. And then it has a seal. What is this? Does anybody know? Um, or did I just pick up a random kid's crew neck? It is tagged a 110 or a size 5. 110 or a size 5 in kid's little crew neck. I just like the walrus. And then I was like, I don't know what this is actually in reference to. So now I feel like I need to do more research. <laughs> All right. And then we have, let's see. Um... This one is a Nike hoodie. This one's nice too. It's like a lightweight Nike hoodie in a size medium. Medium, nice little gray, lightweight hoodie. Medium in women's on this one. And it is running right now for you guys. We got 15 minutes left in this little haul. Um, and then I'm going to have to spit out a lot of here. I wish I could keep going. I wish we could just go through all of these bags. <laughs> but I unfortunately have an appointment tonight. Thank you, that green room. That is all yours. Thank you so much. So here, I'll try and like speed it up just a little bit to show you guys a few more things before I go. This one's really cute. Size medium and it's brand new. There we go. Brand new from Eco Threads. Oh, it's so cute. This would be really cute with some little docks. Um, it has little puff sleeves that are kind of like a flutter. It's a boxy size medium. So if you are a size large, you could totally get away with this. But it's a little floral dress and it has like a very boxy fit to it. Size medium, brand new with tags. Not today. Um, I don't think I'm going to get to them today, but I have more in my Boho Coastal show. Running right now for you guys. This one is new with tags, size medium, but will fit a size large. Two seconds left. It's really cute. Uh, but, but yeah, so no, I don't think I'll get it, get to them tonight. Watch as I say that I probably will pull them next. <laughs> uh, but, but yeah, I know that I have some in my upcoming shows. Okay. Another little hoodie for you guys. This one's cool. This one's like a little hoodie in the t-shirt in one. By the brand Zia size large. Zia activewear size large on this one. And it's like a little quilted hoodie. And then it has the long sleeve detail to it as well. Oh, mother, yes. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Size large on this one. Zia active running right now. And it has hidden pockets on the sides as well. Fuzzy. Let me get that off there. There we go. Yay. Thank you so much, Alicia. Um, but I, you're okay, though. <laughs> we are going to try and do these more often. I think this is going to be like a goal for Monday shows going forward. Um, yeah. 
Dang it, mother. I'm so sorry. Uh, but yeah, I've just, I've been on for, I think, almost two hours now. Dang it. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say Z is a really good brand. So that's a great pickup. This next one. Okay. I love this. It gives like monster energy, kind of like the Y2K vibe. Um, yeah, basically, I always start at 3.30. Today, we started at 3, so it was a little bit earlier. But yeah, 3.30 is usually my normal start time for shows. Um, and I think that going forward, my Mondays for the next 12 months have appointments at 5.30 for this like counseling program I'm getting into. So I think the plan going forward is to do Monday shows just like this. Like literally every Monday, you guys are going to come in and we're going to do a haul of my bins finds. I don't know if that's something you guys will be down for, but I was just like, was trying to figure out ways to make it more like interactive as well. So I think that'll work. <laughs> there you go. Oh, thank you, mother. I appreciate it. Yeah, but I thought this would be kind of fun to do more because I, I miss this part of my shows, you know? But yeah, so I figured every Monday we do this. I kind of get to like unwind before my therapy appointment. I don't have to like worry about stressing, like shipping everything. And then like, I also get to have fun and go through my stuff with you guys because that's like the best part of my job. <laughs> so Brandy Melville, one size, I would say up to a size medium running right now. This one's like a little v-neck and then it has like the green stitching coming through as well. This one's really cute actually. Uh, but usually the brandy stuff I feel like I'm like back and forth on, but this one was just some, such a good casual piece and it was a size one size. But like I say, I always say like up to a medium for brandy. <laughs> uh, but well, I'm glad you guys like this format. I, I really enjoy doing it this way, honestly. Thank you, Zan. I appreciate you. It's a lot more fun. Zan Court is okay. Can we just give a second? to Zan's bundle today, because I think she gets the, the winning bundle. That is an adorable bundle, Zan. Such a good pickup. <laughs> that is so cute. Okay, and then let me get this back over here so I don't get them out of order. <laughs> Thank you, Zan. You guys always have like the cutest bundles whenever I package them up, but sometimes I'll write it on your guys' little invoices. I'll be like, such a cute bundle. <laughs> um, do we need to bookmark shows to get notified online or will it give notifies? Um, I actually don't know. I think you still need to bookmark them um, to play it safe, but I actually am not sure on that because I know that they updated it, but I would recommend bookmarking because whatnot is so glitchy anyways, uh, but I would just recommend it. <laughs> you still have to bookmark. Isn't that lovely? I wish it was the other way around. New with tags. <laughs> there you go. You're like, I'm going to play this safe. New with tags uh, from H&M and it says unicorn unicorn believer. Um, and here we go. New with tags running right now. Yeah. I think that's one thing that I feel like they really size large, sorry. Um, I really need to work on is the notification system for shows. Yeah. Size large new with tags. Um, really desperately need help with that because I think that's what really hinders a show too. Not that I like feel like you guys don't show up, but I feel like I I feel like a lot of my followers don't get notifications for my shows and I wish they did. Um, cause I have, I think we just hit 13,000 followers on here and I feel like <laughs> I feel like nobody gets notifications for my shows. <laughs> Old Navy tractor print. I just know that your kiddos, um, some of your guys' kiddos are in, really into tractors right now. Size 5T on these ones and they're running right now for you guys. Oh, thank you, mother. <laughs> uh, but thank you, Arden. I'm glad you enjoy these ones. Yeah, and, I, and this is how I started when I was on Whatnot too. So that's why I was like, I feel like I got to bring it back. Um, even with bookmarks, <laughs> but I know Riley time. <laughs> well, as I say, a lot of you guys that have been here for a while you guys are just used to it like three o'clock hits and you're like oh time to log into whatnot um which is like also just like so surreal to me like I'm like so grateful for that and I hope you guys know that but like I pinch myself every day being like what people people want to watch me <laughs> so I appreciate you guys um that's what you did today <laughs> appreciate you guys so much. I literally don't deserve you guys. But yeah, I, I see that's what I was like explaining to my like my local following. I was like trying to like kind of prepare them. Ah, uh oh, now I can't find the top. Oh, shoot. I told somebody I didn't have a baby Grogu. Hi, how are you Chanel? Uh oh, because <laughs> I do have but he looks so old. Why does he look like he has seen some shit? Um, <laughs> Anyways, let's run him. I know I just told somebody I did not have Grogu, and I definitely do. I'm so sorry. Um, he, I mean, he is technically old, right? Star Wars tag on him as well. Running right now. He's got beans in his butt, so he's kind of like a weighted style. <laughs> I know that does sound like a vibe. I will buy the goth stuff. It just be on the lookout. <laughs> Sounds good. Well, we have a goth drop in, I think, two weeks. Yeah, I was going to say, we do, we do a show completely dedicated to goth. Um, if you go on my profile, there should be one scheduled. Maybe I don't have one scheduled. 
If you don't see one on my profile, DM, DM me and I'll send it to you once I schedule it, okay? Um, that's my favorite show to source for. Yeah, we do one every two and a half weeks right now is another goth show. Okay, this next one is a little quarter zip. Is the zipper not working? Or is Riley just zipper broken? Oh no, Riley's just zipper broken. Um, anyways, <laughs> my wallet hates that show. <laughs> This one is a nice little half zip, you guys, and it's from the brand Trendy Queen, and it's a size medium. Trendy Queen size medium, running right now for you guys. There we go. Uh, but kind of like a sagey um, aqua green color, and it looks like the Lulu zip ups, honestly. Thank you, Sage. Knit tops and goth stuff and these. Okay, Arden. Arden, okay. Welcome to Sensory Finds, first of all. <laughs> um, I dedicate all of my shows to certain themes. So this right now is actually not normal at all for me. All of my shows are always theme oriented. So basically you come in and it's a whole day dedicated to one theme. So it can be boho coastal, earthy tones neutrals, gothic, fairy tale romance, you name it, I do it. Um, so basically, <laughs> you got to go to my profile. You got to see what I offer. Um, I do all kinds of shows. If you're looking for knit tops, um, I would recommend bookmarking the Boho Coastal show. Um, see, I just found one. And yeah, and a frog and toad drop too. Um, but yeah, so I would recommend bookmarking those shows so you don't miss them. Okay, see, I'm going to message you about these ones, okay? Um, Alicia, yes, I do. Um, I offer personalized style boxes. Hi, Sora. Oh, you're fine. You're fine, Sora. How are you? Of course I remember. <laughs> How are you? Yeah, see, I'm going to message you. So there's this one, this um, St. John, size medium. I literally, I kid you not, I shit myself when I found this. <laughs> um, but no, right, that's a green flag right there. But welcome back, Sora. I hope you're doing well. <laughs> I'm good. Thank you for asking. And then there's a blue one, St. John, size large. And then there is a green one. And you get first dibs, okay? So I'm going to message you. And the green one is a medium, St. John. But yeah, so I'm putting these to the side for you, okay? Now that I have found them. <laughs> um, isn't that pretty though? So they are, they have a dib on them right now. If they get passed on, I will let you guys know, okay? Uh, but, but yeah, so, and these, uh, but, so those will still keep on claim because I do have one other person behind you. Uh, but there's a little bit of a line. So I that's the one issue that I have when I start doing like pre-claims is that I start getting um, pre-claims that back up and then I get really stressed. So there is a little bit of a line on those ones, but I'll let you guys know if they pass, okay? Absolutely, thank you. And thanks for messaging so quick about them. I kid you not, it was literally like, boom, boom, somebody else tried to claim them and I was like, sorry they're pending um next up you guys this one is hooray and it's a size large little like teddy lace detail to it size large but yeah of course i'm so glad you like them i literally was so excited to find them two seconds left on those ones all ready and let's see we've got um let's do this one over here i think this is a nordstrom dress was my time we've got four minutes um yeah i would say it's like a semi sheer sarah a little bit see-through size large by mystery it's another good brand actually here we go size oh ooh. Ooh, I think this is what we're going to end the show on, you guys. This is a good one. This is a jumpsuit, and I didn't even realize it was a jumpsuit until now. It has pockets. It is a nice little v-neck to it. This is classy. Oh, I'm jealous. I am actually really sad because I probably would have probably would have kept this. Belt around the waist as well. And then it has a zipper in the back. Wide leg jumpsuit. Sits like a man. This is beautiful. Mystery size large. And you know this is not a cheap brand either. Um, I'm pretty sure it's either Nordstrom. I can't remember. Wide leg jumpsuit. And it's full length in a size large. And then it has a belt that goes around. And it does have pockets as well. This is a beautiful piece though. Really classy. Thank you, Alicia. That is all yours. What a great pickup. Let's see what Goodwill was asking. But was at the $9.99. So what a steal. Great pickup. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I think, do I got time? I got time. Let's do one more. Let's see. Here's another little knit tank top since we were on that topic. Extra small Madewell. Extra small Madewell. This one's cute. Little neutral top and then it has like a little tie at the bottom right there. Yeah, this one's cute. Extra small Madewell. Nice little neutral piece. You might be able to fit a small if you wanted a tighter fit. Made well extra small. I know. I'm sorry, Sage. I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, and then let's see. Let me see. I'm gonna try and crank out like two more, maybe. Okay. Never mind. 
Let's do, you guys wanna see what I pulled from my storefront really quick? Cause I promised I would show you guys. So we'll stop the haul here. We got through a lot. We got through like two bags. <laughs> um, so thank you. But I'll show you guys really quick. Oh my goodness. The stuff I pulled from my store. Okay. Kids corduroys, little um, baggy pants. These are so cute. This is a velvet maxi and like a chocolate brown with a lace hem. And like I said, like after my first opening, grand opening on day one, I think what I'll do is pop up in the store and do a show for you guys as well. And then this is primitive. Oh, the sleeves all tucked in still. Primitive Dragon Ball Z. This thing is sick. It's like fully embroidered too. That's actually not from my storefront. That's from my website. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, that's the plan. Um, this this one is really cool, and I might keep this one for myself, honestly. This one, it um, on the back here, it says, don't follow me, I'm following my heart. And then on the front, it says, get some sleep. Isn't that sick, though? It's like a size large, foresty green. It's so pretty. I know, I love this one so much. And that's why I'm like, I kind of want to keep it. Pendleton, new with tags. It says, don't follow me, I'm following my heart. It's a little Pendleton cosmetic bag. It has little spots, but got the tag still on it. <laughs> and then I found another Western bag, which I was very excited for because these are my favorite types of bags to find. Let's see. I found, I don't know why this was in here. Okay. Then I found a nineties Levi's denim jacket. This thing is so cool. I love this one little 90s denim from Levi's and then I got let's see this, one, this one's very random um but it's a little kids backpack that was new with tags from Cat and Jack because I'm gonna have a little kids corner so I thought that'd be really cute to hang on the wall this is really random as well but um um, I'm keeping it for the storefront mother, but if it doesn't get claimed, I will let you know, okay? Um, these are really random, but they're reusable paper towels. <laughs> and I, anytime I find sustainable products like this, I always pick them up. And now that I have a storefront, I think this will be a really good little filler piece in like my displays and stuff. So there's like reusable um, paper towels, really random, but excited for those. <laughs> this is a very exciting piece. This one is a vintage L.L. Bean genuine leather crossbody wallet slash purse. This thing is beautiful. Um, so I was very excited for that. And then I found this vintage dress. This one is so pretty. Look how pretty this is. It's giving fairy tale romance. And this is where this will go into the fairy tale romance drop. Um, full lace as well. And then there's two more down here. Yeah. Okay, this one Lucas found for me yesterday, actually. I know I've got, I've got like one minute and then I gotta hop off. <laughs> this one is the Oregon Coast. I'm keeping this one for myself because I thought this was so cool. Yeah, my whole store is gonna be themed sections and then it rotates every two weeks to a different theme. Um, so it'll basically have two to three drops on the floor at a time and then it will rotate completely every two weeks so that my customers local also get to experience the themed drops basically. It's gonna be really cool. Yeah, I, and that's all I thought too, Sarah. <laughs> and then the last thing I'm gonna show you guys and then I gotta hop off for my appointment. No. I know. I thought that'd be so cool, right? <laughs> oh, Arden, thank you so much. Let me accept it right now. Here, let me go to my offers. Yes, absolutely. Those are all yours. Let me see. Accept. Thank you, Arden. I really appreciate that. Um, last piece. I might keep this for myself to wear on opening day, but how pretty is this? I love it so much. It's American Eagle too. Thank you so much, I, um, Arden. I really appreciate that. But yeah, so anyways. Anyways, <laughs> so that's basically the kind of like a little haul. Um, I didn't get through it. Absolutely. Absolutely. I'll price it high. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'll price it high in the store so nobody touches it. Um, but it's just kidding. Just kidding. But um, anyways, so I plan to stream the storefront as well for you guys, like the um, grand opening, at least for the first hour when I like cut the ribbon and everything. Yeah, we'll do like a stream then. And then the next day after that, we'll let you guys go through the racks as well. So I am going to hop off before I run out of time, but plan to see this every Monday. Um, I do have the next one scheduled as well for next Monday for the bins haul. Just go book markets. This will be something that we put into rotation. Um, you guys should probably start seeing this 
starting this week. So yes, thank you, Shelbo. I will check um, right after this, okay? Yes, of course, of course. Thank you, Katie. I really appreciate you. So thank you, thank you. I hope that you guys have a really good day. Um, I will be back on tomorrow with an all Nike show at I think 3.30 or 5.30. I can't remember. It's a different time because this week I also run the estate sale. So don't forget, like that's why my schedule looks funky this week is just because I'm also trying to help out with an estate sale, making sure that goes smoothly, okay? So little funky schedule. Next week we return back to normal, okay? Alrighty. I'm gonna go ahead and hop off. I hope you guys have a great evening. Let me see if I can send you guys somewhere here. Let's run the buyer's giveaway really quick as well before I forget. Buyer's giveaway is running right now. And then let me see if anybody's on right now that we can go to. Thank you again, everybody. I really appreciate you guys. Um, no, I don't see anybody on. Let's just go women's category. Lowest view. Oh, their sort feature is still broken. Okay, never mind. Well, anyways, we're gonna go ahead and run this giveaway and then I've gotta go, you guys. So five, four, three, two, one, and we're gonna run that. Thank you again, everybody, so much for all the support today. I appreciate you guys. I'm glad you guys enjoyed this format. Hopefully we can continue doing this, okay? Congratulations, Cheyenne. So I will be back on tomorrow, okay? If you have any questions, feel free to DM me here or on Instagram, either way, I am sort of caught up on Instagram um, DMs. I'm caught up on DMs in general, mostly. I did that this weekend. So if I did miss your DM, please DM me again. It means that my messaging apps have kind of blocked your DM because it says I'm caught up. But if I scroll far enough, I find more DMs that are unread. So message me if you have not received a response from me. Even if it was two months ago, please message me again. You are not bothering me. I just lose DMs because I get so many that at some point it stops notifying me and they get pushed all the way to the bottom. So I apologize, but I am mostly caught up on DMs. So like I said, if you have any questions, DM me. If you want to claim something you changed your mind on, just DM me as well. And yeah. All right. I'm going to hop off. I've got an appointment to get to. I hope you guys have a great evening. Thank you again for hanging out with me tonight. This was a lot of fun and I'm excited to start doing this again with you guys. So until tomorrow, I hope you guys have a great evening and thank you again for hanging out with me. Um, let me see if I can find somebody really quick that's just on the top here that we can go to. It doesn't even want me to go. It just keeps recommending Pokemon sellers to me. All right, we're going to hop off, you guys. <laughs> I hope you guys have a great evening. Thank you again, everyone, for hanging out with me. I'll see you guys all tomorrow, okay? <laughs>